Hello. How y'all doing? What's up, rumbly tumbly? Oh, God. It's gonna, it's gonna be, it's gonna be the new name I call you every stream. Hey, my rumble tumbles. Who <laughs> hell? There'll be none of you left in like a week. Oh God. I think like the most, the most, the most like audience name we have is Hey Gamers. I think I'm gonna use the call and you like gamers or hello chatters. Either that or like I'll individually point someone out and give them a real scare. Steven. Someone's shitting themselves now. Someone's really scared. Whoa, what the fuck? Says Steven and chat. <laughs> we got him. <laughs> He's actually there. Oh, God. Sorry to scare you, Steven. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Oh, God. So, yeah, how you doing, folks? I hope everyone's having a good week. What's What's going on? people a chance to hop on in the stream. I've watched all the YouTube uploads on this game. Am I all caught up? Uh, no, you are one stream behind. You are one stream behind. So almost entirely, but not quite. Uh, the highlights of the latest stream will be going up tomorrow, I believe. So just one off. We're just a little bit ahead and hopefully going to be finishing the game today, or at least the base game. I, I understand there's a lot of post-game content. And just There was literally a patch for this game like yesterday. To, like add it new stuff. I think it was yesterday. Um, and th that's added some new content, like a new event or something, which is cool. Like the devs are still supporting. It's a free update too. Uh, we'll check out some of that today. We're just we're just gonna go like about four or five hours, and we'll see where we end up. I think it's the best way to do it. I'm not really interested in 100% completing this one. Just because it, it seems a bit torturous to catch every fish. That's the main reason. That's the main deterrent. Um, but I am hugely enjoying it. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Alright, today's my birthday tomorrow. Happy early birthday to you. Hope you have a lovely one. He hates it. No, stop this. I don't hate everything. <laughs> He didn't dedicate 60 hours to this one. Oh, he despises it. Someone's trying to get 100% getting all the jows. Is it, well, the, the jows is a pay. Oh, God. Do you have to do the Tamagotchi thing to 100%? Oh, God. Like, fuck that. Okay, no, we're not doing that then. That sounds torturous. Seriously, do you even like the game? Dave is more interested in sharks. He doesn't want to register all the fishes. Yeah, I, uh, the thing is, I, I had something spoiled for me because I actually read the patch notes. Uh, apparently, there is something exclusive for if you document all the fish. Um, it's, it's literally in the patch notes. I was just reading up. It's like, oh, what's new? Uh, you know, I did not expect that to just be there so plainly. Uh, we'll see how we get on, though. We're just going to play. We're just gonna play. Last time I said, like, like historically, like, we're not gonna 100% this. I was fucking in, like, the pantheon of Hollow Nest and Hollow Knight. Uh, I'm, like, doing stupid shit. <laughs> so, you never know. Oh, God. Just giving people a chance to hop on in and then we'll get going. You don't like a game until you 100% complete it. Thank you. 
Who would you win the, win the fight, the knight or Dave? Dave, Dave, Dave is superior, I think, in almost every respect. He, he's the perfect man. You know, you, you cannot beat him. He's an apex predator. You look massive today, good sir. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, God. I, I, I'm not sure if I should have th taught you guys like that Irish expression because it's it's so it's so easy like, you got to be real careful with that one those those don't know um in Ireland if you say god you're looking massive uh that ac actually means you're looking great it, it doesn't mean what you think it does <laughs> Um, but now, obviously, it's not used too much because there's <laughs> misunderstandings <laughs> when it is used. So you gotta, you gotta be careful with it. OMG, I thought we were waiting for IRT, but I just had it muted. Oh, God, love you. How's it going? <laughs> Damn girl, you looking massive. Yeah, but maybe maybe not with a damn girl. I I don't think it's gonna go well. <laughs> Absolutely gigantic. That's just rude. Just, no, you cannot interchange the word massive. It's only the word massive. Don't start saying like God, you look enormous today. No, like that th at that point, like you've you're going really off course. <laughs> you look fucking huge. <laughs> like at that point, it's just really mean and un unwarranted, you know. You gotta be careful. Creature, thank you for 500 bits. Hey, RT, I hope you and chat are having a good day. Thank you very much. Hope you are too. You look so Dynamax today. <laughs> That's just insulting. Ah, oh, God. You think you play Resident Evil or some spooky games for Halloween? Um, I I think the lead idea for a Halloween stream has been to, for me to just play something quite peaceful, but add the lead pipe sound effect. And to be honest, I like that idea the most. But it's just randomly while I'm playing, a lead pipe is gonna drop and scare the shit out of me. That, that's my favorite idea for Halloween so far. I find like a Kirby game or something. So that, that's not a horror game, but it's like true horror there. Base boosted lead pipe. We need to be like different sound effects so it throws you for a loop or something. I'll, I'll, I'll see what I can find. Maybe we can re rewire it so some of the alerts are just different kinds of lead pipes. Oh, do I give you that much power? Oh, uh, no, that, that might be a horrible idea. <laughs> that might not be a good idea. But that, that that's my lead idea for Halloween. I don't know if I'll be streaming on Halloween night itself. I'll probably stream like Halloween afternoon. Probably in the afternoon. We'll be doing stuff around Halloween though. City Skylines 2 will be out too. Mario Wonder will be out. We're gonna have we're gonna have a lot to play after this week, honestly. Still have the uh, like, there's still like a shitload of stuff that came out too that I've just not got around to. I actually do I I've been kinda on the fence about Armored Core. I might give it a look at some point. Just a load of games, like all back to back. Betty Die 3, yeah, like that that came out too. I've been waiting for that just to be port to Steam and me to have VR. I think it's I think it's only on um, Oculus at the moment, which I just don't have a headset of anymore. Yeah, the, a shitload of stuff just came out. Lies of P. Yeah, I, I heard that's really good too. I'll, I'll hold off on that one probably just because I Sekiro is promised, and that's like similar style game, you know. The Souls like. Yeah, we're gonna. It's a good time for games. Like, Jesus. Like, we've so much. 
Have you heard of a game called Detective Pikachu? <laughs> oh shit! I'm glad people have enjoyed the suffering <laughs> showcase. The low lights, if you will. Honestly, because I, 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 we've joked about like the worst of our T game before, and producing it on this channel, uh, where it's just like all the worst stream moments, just all compiled into one handy video, where it's like nothing's happening. It's like, hang on, guys, my audio correct? Like worst of RT game, like 2023. Uh, you can make like half that just Detective Pikachu and me walking back and forth. No joke, you 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 can make a significant portion of that video just Detective Pikachu. Just the awkward silences and pauses. Alright, well, thanks for doing your bits. Hey Dan, would you sign my copy of Detective Pikachu Returns at TwitchCon? Um. I will sign it, but I'll write a mean message on it as well about the game. Those are my terms. It'd be like, why the fuck have you bought this? Love RT. <laughs> um, no, I, I think those are reasonable terms. It's coming up to five years where well, you said during Minecraft story mode then five years time you'd be a washed up content creator and yet here you are. Oh shit. <laughs> that means I've only got like a week left. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna come back from like Twitch God and that. It's like he's just not the same anymore. Time to pack up. Make this final week count. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so, uh, just, and, yeah, just housekeeping as ever. I'm saying at the start of all the streams next week, well, just while people are about. Um, I'm streaming this week. There's no streams next week. I'm off. TwitchCon's happening. I'm gonna be hanging out in Vegas a few days. Um, just taking a week break. It's a bit unfortunate timing-wise, because I know literally Sea of the Islands 2 and Mario Wonder are out next week. But I'll get to them just a bit after release. We'll, we'll definitely be playing them. So no worries there. We make a vlog? I'll probably get some funny photos with, with folks. Dan, now that you're old, what knee gives you the least pain? Um... I think, I th I think it's my right knee. I think my left knee is the one uh, like has always been a bit weird and achy. Unfortunately. We can fix that. I can't tell if that's like fix the achy knee or make my working knee worse. I thought your lung was worse. Well the lung is the worst thing, yeah. Fucking fucking wheezy lung here. Uh <laughs> It's the one I have the most trouble with. Oh god, let me hold my glass as well. Uh, hi Dan, I, uh, your con has been helping me a whole lot recently, so I just want to say thank you. I got out of the hospital for depression recently. Watching your videos and streams has been a huge help, so thank you very much for being here. Hey, no problem, I'm glad to hear it. I hope you're feeling okay. Glad you're feeling better. Uh, thank you very much uh, there, glasses. Be doing all right. I think your your username reminded me there to put on my own glasses. <laughs> let me just let me just polish these up. No, I'm glad you're feeling better though. It's good to hear. I know where to get a new lung. I I don't know what you're suggesting by that. But I know a guy. I know a guy. Oh, God. I, I realize as well, most of this week, we've had, like, such a lengthy intro and starts um, to the streams. Because, uh, like, just chat in the chat. I I'm honestly tempted to just make Sunday, like, just a talking stream. Like, we'll do some Pokemon Shiny on. So I feel like, like, even right now, I feel like we could just be here for, like, an hour. Without even playing the game. 
I love the talking time. Yeah, I, I really like the talking time before we like kind of get into things too. It's just nice. Um, but yeah, maybe we might do that on Sunday. Um, see what the plan is. Figure it out. Yes, this is nice. Yes, however, sharks. Maybe we can do some shiny hunting or like go fishing in Animal Crossing again. I love the Animal Crossing chill time. I haven't played it in a while too. See how my town's doing. I think I have to like de weed it again. <laughs> Animal Crossing on Switch sounds four years old as well. I, I was thinking about that the other day. It's wild. I think I have like 800 hours in that game or something ridiculous. Yeah, maybe we might do that on Sunday. I, I think I have something fun for Saturday stream. Assume we finish Dave today and like we're not talking for an hour. Let me let me let me put this. It's not even on the screen proper. Hang on. Let me actually put it on the screen so we edge ever closer. Come on. There we go. Yeah, maybe we might do something like that on Sunday. I'll, I'll, I'll see how I'm feeling. Am I the only one that hates Animal Crossing? Uh, it's not for everyone. Honestly, it, it's a kind of game where it's, I very much understand why people do not like it. Because it's very slow and gradual and takes a shitload of time. Um, but yes, you're also the only person who doesn't like it. And unfortunately, we're going to have to ban you from the chat now. Very sorry. <laughs> no, no, but um, no, I, 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 I honestly get why that game's not for everyone. I personally love it. Self reports. <laughs> no, I, 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 I completely understand why people are not about that game. Completely get it. But God, I love it. I'm not one of those people. <laughs> Mods crush that guy's balls <laughs> from Barry B. Ballin. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Barry Ballin is given the command. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> yes, Chef. Least arranged RT game fan. Holy shit. Uh, anyway, uh, Dave the Diver. Do as Barry says. You don't want Barry to be balling on your case, right? <laughs> he sounds like a man who gets stuff done. Oh, Sammy's calling. What's up, Dave? You doing good? See Mary Jack today. Yeah. You come to the chicken farm real quick. I got something to show you. Chicken farm upgrade. Now, there's been an update since the last time we played. It's actually downloaded, so... This may, I, this may just be like utter base game progression content or this may actually be new content that was literally just added to the game um so we're gonna check it out and we'll just see what's new oh god look at all our chickens what's going on sammy i was browsing the internet to buy a new instrument i found some awesome stuff on sale for a limited time so i bought them just before the sale ended now you don't need to worry about coming to the chicken farm when you're busy at the first item is an egg storage box. Storage can keep up to 50 eggs. Yeah. You don't have to collect eggs every day. You can just go wait until it fills up and collect them all in one go. Oh, shit. That's actually really handy. Mm. Get out. Behold the chicken yeah. feeder. The machine automatically feeds your chickens and increases the egg production rate. Yeah. Oh, you can actually automate it. <laughs> right. <laughs> I mean, that's 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 pretty cool. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm, I'm instantly buying them. That's really cool. We can min-max it. Yes. Purchase an egg storage box. You can store up to 50 eggs out of harvest them. You can use the cell feeder to automatically feed your chickens. Increase the egg production rate depending on the type of feed. Uh, oh, it's 17 grand. Holy shit. Oh, it's so much money. 
Oh, God. What, what does it make sense to invest in first? I think probably, yeah, probably the chicken feeder stuff. Can I automate the farm here? Is there an option for that? I can expand the field. I just, I just spent eight grand on that. God, it's so expensive. There's no way to automate that, I think. It's a lot of money, but I, I think we still have to invest in it. Uh, Miracle Tortoise, thank you for the uh, five quid there. Dave, thank you for all your hard work in my neighborhood. It's been so much safer since you brutally murdered all the sharks. Some people say you're a monster, but I think you're a force for good. Can you harpoon the lone sharks next? Uh, thank you, Miracle Tortoise. It's a fan of Dave's work. <laughs> okay, hang on. Uh, Alright, I'll... I'll get that soon. I don't mind checking on the eggs each day for now. Let's buy a chicken feeder. Can I, can I have more chickens too now? Look at that. It's so cute. I don't think we have any white chickens. Okay, there we go. All right, we're, we're maxed out on chickens. This is as many as we can get. Let's cram them on in. Okay, we're gonna be making eggs for days. Hopefully the eggs are profitable enough and we can actually put the money then in like the, the farm here. Harvest up fertilizer. Is that the one I want? Oh no, I, I can't add it at the moment because I think I already have a fertilizer. I need, I need to wait for everything to like kind of grow at the same time. I need to like standardize this better. Uh, lesbians, thank you for 300 bits. IRT, I've been really enjoying the content, especially these Dave streams. Can't wait to see what lies at the end. Thank you very much. Automation is the legit a part of the new update. So I can automate the chickens, I'm guessing. Thank you, lesbians. There's lesbians for German there. Thank you. Uh, yogurt, thank you for five quid as well. Just want to tell everyone that while watching you uh, list off everything horrible about the Pikachu game, I was really interrupted by an ad for the game. I'm so sorry. Very sorry to hear that. I think it is kind of ironic, because yeah, people have been reporting that even on YouTube, that people have gotten a lot of ads for Detective Pikachu Returns. Specifically on the video we made. Which is hilarious to me. Let's feed the cat. Staff is working away. Can I train staff anymore? What was the max level of staff? People said it was like rank 20. Can't even afford to train him. Actually, wait, no, I think I can. Hang on. James, it's your turn. There we go. It's rank 20 for staff. Okay. Just gotta keep investing. So we make more profits. Uh, it's Marilyn of season coming up soon, is it? It's a party on Tuesday. I mean, before all of this, I think we have to go and like, fight the final boss or whatever's happening at the bottom of the ocean. It's our next goal. Improve the Marilyn. Get specialty dishes. 425 for boiled sailfish and seaweed. Holy shit. That makes six portions as well. Oh, there's a bunch of new ones, too. 
He's all only cost one. Blobfish spring roll? These weren't here before. Were they? Oh, they might have been actually. No, that, that, I think these actually happen here. I remember the hump head now. Okay, um. Let's see. Is something new here? I can call Vincent. I can call the operator. Oh, I hope you're having a nice day. Please know this call is being recorded for quality assurance. What can I help you with today? Claim reward? Chosen to claim the reward. Please enter the promotion code. Uh. Dave? Try sea blue forever. Sea blue has been unlocked. Oh, okay. It's like there's actual promo codes now. You won a prize. Congratulations. The day's fortune. Don't forget and prepare the festival, or so it says. <laughs> what a fortune. <laughs> My information. You got the 302 items to in total. You've worked hard. Okay. That's new. Uh, I can call Vincent now as well. Does Vincent have anything to say? He's not picking up. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad I can find I can call him now. <laughs> That. We're gonna gradually get enough followers. I need better taste for diamond rank. Look at the timeline. It's still eating after film and it stopped. He must have really liked it. Look at everyone tweeting about our stuff. MC Sammy. Give it all a heart. Thumbs up on everything. Please post about us. Okay, Eco Watcher. Anything else I can do here? Deliver. Defeat the invasive starfish. Fierce battle was fought. Investigate ecology. So many. I don't think I want to deliver the seaweed, yeah. I think I might actually need that for some recipes. Me when funny Pokemon meme. <laughs> okay, um, do I want to check out the fish farm? No. No, I, I, I think I just want to leave that mess as is. Okay, let's dive to the bottom of the ocean. Let's just head on down. Have my gun. Have all the charms I can need. Um, there is a jellyfish with a wizard hat. We will check him out later. I think we have time to catch him. Let's actually beat the game. Let's just, let's just see how... Let's just go for it, yeah. And we'll check out some of the extra stuff, too. Finally see what's happening all the way down here. I feel like I want to get like a few extra supplies under my belt before I just dive straight down. I might want to get like an extra oxygen tank and shit. There tends to be a few sharks that we can just collect. Get the Greenland one. It's always worth a lot. Oh! Ground is rumbling again. Get more intense. I should quickly go down to the control. No, I'm looking for sharks. Hang on. We have time. We have time. Just, just to pick up a few. Fuck. Put him to sleep. Put him to sleep. Okay, bring him home. We're gonna get, grab just a few real quick.
So I'm, gonna, I'm definitely gonna need more oxygen now before we fight like the final boss. I hope it's a shark. <laughs> It'll make my day. Ripple, flame, axle. Sir. Sir, please. Come on, get out of here. Just pick him up. So many collectathon quests just from the Eco Watcher. The world has ended. Mmm, sharks. Like, Dave, the ocean trench is going to collapse. I wonder if I can make some new types of sushi. Right, we gotta get some oxygen before we go all the way down, too. Uh, the Greenland shark like to hang around here, I think. And then there's, like, the dinosaur shark at the bottom. Hey, friend. Package them up. I'm, I'm honestly shocked the tiny drone can tackle this heavy load. <laughs> Look at him go, he's massive. Get rotated. I think it's a bit more than getting rotated, it's like get packaged <laughs> and shipped via Amazon. There was one more shark over here. I want to try again. Come on. Come on, stop being hazardous. There we go. Grab some of that. Okay, there's ammo here that we can come back and grab. Get shrink wrap sealed. Look at chat as well. It's like any Twitch primers in chat? I've Twitch primer I've not heard of. There's a paid actor in chat. Wait, uh, I think you're actually new. I should probably keep you. Fish net it. Like, uh, all I can think is like a primer is in like paint when someone says that. I'm a primer and proud. I am the base coat that gets painted over. Oh. Hello there. What's this? There's something there, but I, I can't tell what. Yeah, this is what I was hoping for. Anyone see the other, like, ancient shark? I don't, I don't know if he's here. It's just a rock. I, I know it's a rock. <laughs> but it was, like, moving. Like, my god. I never realized. Uh, maybe the ancient shark is over the other end. Let me, let me just like skirt clear of the final boss one moment longer. It knows you're here. It knows I'm hunting for him. There he is. Oh, we're just gonna get pick you up while we're here too. Come on. Yeah, you're coming with me, bud. Oh, God. He's got armor. <laughs> there we go. It's like a critical when you hit him from below. Little prehistoric shark. To be turned into sushi. Another dunkle acquired. 
Yeah, there's bullets on the left side over here, too. Let's go get them first. The shark bought its own armor plate and seen your streams. It's like, all my friends. They've all been served up and eaten. is open. Now you'll be able to go in. The hot air coming out from inside. It's not a good sign. Be careful. Go to a new region. Actually descend into hell. The roots have severely mutated. The door is blocked by tree sap. Should be a way to go inside. This is the control room. Only up to one sushi-loving diver. Save the day. You can hear like Bowser's Castle like final music playing. Let me just grab this guy. Is he just gonna eat it? Go do it. He really does it. Oh, there's something here. Okay, maybe maybe that's what I'm supposed to do with him. The way is open. I passed it. No, Mr. Snail. Oh, the pad is cut off. Dave is now in incredible danger. Outer parts are blocked up by this tree sap as well. Sea scorpion and mutated divine tree fruit. This is terrible. We must somehow find a way. Holy sh that's like a full on scorpion. God. It's a, it's a lot, it's a mean lobster. That's what it is. Megaloraptus. The snail hates us, clearly. Something here. Okay, don't don't do that. God, there's a lot of them. We're gonna have some ancient lobster soon. Pull it out and drop. I'm assuming that's what it wants me to do. Yeah, we have bombs for this one. Pop the sap using this mutated divine tree fruit. Oh, I drop this mutated divine free tree fruit onto the door I saw earlier. Am I gonna be able to take it back all the time? God, we updated, upgraded the harpoon. These guys are taking a lot of damage. Come on. Dave must transport the explosives now. The hydrothermal vent is blocking the door. Anyway, to stop the water jet. Oh, okay. I'm not. I'm not supposed to just carry that with me. It's gonna blow. Go. Deploy the snail. It's a massive crater. The top wall looks loose. It may collapse if the crater erupts a little a little higher. He's, he's gonna block here. Oh, okay, you gotta you gotta get them all. Let's 
It's gonna, it's gonna take just a bit of setup just to get them all near. Come on, Dave. Cooking snails. There's one. <laughs> These guys are panicking. It's like, oh no. The diver, he's coming for us. Okay, st stay still. Stay still. No, stay still. Stay. Oh, God damn it. I can do it. Don't move. Don't move. God damn it. Can, can I kill them? <laughs> Okay, I, I think I see what to do. I'm gonna drop this guy. From here, and then just quickly... Doing something wrong. If I pop him here, does he just walk off by himself? Yes, he does. <laughs> I'm still just fucking it up. Okay. I think I got it. Oh, the game glitched. Not right now. God, thank you. Oh, Jesus. The way is now open. I should bring the divine tree fruit here with me. Yeah, let's get this. We, we used a lot of oxygen. I think I think someone was comparing me to Sisyphus there. I think I saw like one must imagine RT happy. It's uncalled for. Got through it. The door is open. It looks spooky inside. I should be careful. There's gonna be a room where it's like there is incredible danger if you proceed. Go, Dave. Time to dive. Oh, this is gonna take us like deeper down than we've ever been to. It's the furthest we've gone, we're like below 600 meters now. What did I assume, like reach up to like 800? We're getting there, we're... Can't be much further. Get him, snail. Uh. 
Get him, snail! I'm so badly hurt! Get through there. Thanks for those gross looking eggs. I attached to divine tree roots. Oh, there's something. Something down here. Strange creatures have hatched from the eggs. Creatures I've seen them in one of the sea people's murals. Tenzin once told me that an ancient engineer altered creatures by infusing the divine tree energy. Maybe the creatures, they've survived for such a long period of time, still breeding. I don't know what's happening. Get sushied. No, oh, they they just die. <laughs> oh god. We're not we're not gonna be serving these guys up in the restaurant. Oh, there's a snail down there, I see him. Catch him with a net gun, not sure about tranquilizer. That's cool enough. Yeah, I think if I shot him now, I think they just die. <laughs> oh, this can't be good. <laughs> Even more eggs here. That that the shape there is a bit unsettling. There might be something in there. Look at the ready to hatch, but I can't go back now. I didn't realize Dave the Diver was gonna turn into like alien. There's a door there. You can melt the mucus covering the door. It's intact divine tree fruit. I put in that divine tree fruit device. I gotcha. This is probably gonna be a bad uh, a mistake. But I need to move him. But the contraption is working. They can melt the mucus by projecting the light from this divine tree fruit. Oh no, the eggs are hatching. I need to get rid of them before I can melt the mucus. Take them on, Dave. Oh wait, wait, can I lift this? Okay, that, that's what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> that was the last of them. Let me melt the mucus cover in the door. I'm supposed to use the laser gun. Uh, that, I think we got one early. I was just born into the world and it immediately explodes. Need to get rid of them before doing anything else. Get him, Dave. I've grown a number. I must open the door and escape. It's melting. More hatching. This time I'll eliminate them once and for all. Get him, Dave. This is it's gonna get worse before it gets better. Oh god! Oh my god! Dave, Dave's in a lot of trouble. Even if we get through this, it's like we don't have much left. Should be the last of them. I must quickly melt the mucus cover in the door before anything else shows up before I run out of oxygen. I think that's the pressing concern. Mm. Nice, the mucus is all gone. Must be the core of the control room over there. Let's find out what it is. <laughs> I there, there there has to be oxygen inside, right? Swim, Dave! He said the dangerous creature's presence enter! 
Um, maybe there's a heal inside. He asks me about that ancient creature is clinging to something. That the nucleus of the divine tree. That'd be why the divine tree is acting strange. You have to get rid of these creatures first. Cause of the earthquake. Swim down, Dave, quickly. Find oxygen. There needs to be something. Quickly, Dave. <laughs> Shit, there's like nothing here. Okay, Dave, just just do what you can. <laughs> He's in incredible danger. The divine tree's nucleus is stabilized again. I guess this should do it. I hope the earthquakes will stop now. So I head back to land. God, I hope I find some oxygen soon. D Dave's gonna just immediately perish. Oh yeah, no, he's fucked. He's he's just dead. <laughs> what on earth is that? Is that the mom of those creatures I saw earlier? None of these eggs are everywhere. D Dave's just dead. Uh... <laughs> oh wait, there's a dro- Please have oxygen. I tracked you down in case you need help. What's going on here? Huge monster came out from the lava. You know what that is? I've seen a lot of texts about the ancient civilization of the sea people. Looks like the creature known as Yai. An ancient beast from legend still alive and it's massively bigger. The sea people's elder told me about some old experiment. Must have absorbed the divine tree and the geothermal energy to get this big. You have to defeat it to stabilize the divine tree. Dave, I'm counting on you. What? How can I possibly defeat such a huge ancient creature? You took down a dinosaur just a moment ago. Dave is the apex predator. It's a different situation. I don't need. I don't even have any weapons or bullets now. Oh, Duff's gonna help us. Dave, this is the weapon right here. Duff, what are you talking about? I told you, this drone has all kinds of hidden features. I knew this day would come, but it was a bit sooner than I expected. I'll input the activation code for the drone's attack mode. Does it have- does it come with oxygen? It can do that. Oh my god, it does. This drone can maintain oxygen levels, fire unlimited bullets, and even manipulate time. Manipulate time? Yeah. Yes, if you press the right mouse, you can temporarily manipulate time. It should give you some time to dodge attacks. Of course, you need to be quick. That's all the help I can give you right now. I hope we won't be saying our final goodbyes. Goodbye, T. No. See you again. See you again, Eternity. Please give us oxygen. Tough, what have you done? You can manipulate time now. Oh, this is a scary looking boy. Catch this one away now, not after getting this far. Alright, let's deal with this. Okay, no, it'll... It'll keep oxygen levels stable. But it won't improve them. So if I drop it, that's it. That means I can't get hit. Keep going, Dave.
No, no, they, they just, they just jump out. All right. This is gonna be a rough. Uh, is it gonna give me? It, it gives me full oxygen after the first death. Thank God. That red meter is how I manipulate time. How much health do we reckon he has? Oh my god, it's literally a bullet hell. Come on, Dave. We can have a few phases. Our current attack level might not be enough. This enemy's tougher than we expected. I didn't want to go this far, but let's unlock the limiter. Why did you never start? It brings out a trump card right at the beginning of a game. Just watch this. Duff is pulling all the stops. I call this the Stella Laser, a superpower laser combined all our tech. Never thought we'd use it underwater. Pay attention, if you hold space, you gather Stella energy. Let go of the button to fire, easy, right? Keep in mind you move slow off charges, so be careful. Good luck, Dave. Charge and fire laser. Great, let's finish it with this. Okay, you cannot slow time while using that. So I got I gotta wait for the attacks to ease up a bit. God. It's pretty strong when you charge it. He's got a lot of tech. Oh no. They're coming closer. It's fucking space invaders with them. Cut him off a bit. There we go. Duff is now wanted by every single government because of this weapon. He's, he's on a list for sure. Trying to run away. If we don't kill it now, we continue to cause problems. Put an end to this once and for all. Finish the job, Dave.
Let's obliterate some of that. <laughs> How does this relate back to sushi? We're getting a prime cut. That's how it relates back. It's gonna be the most valuable dish on the menu. When we're done. Come on, Dave. Gonna be the best shrimp fried rice known to man. Oh god, he's actually getting me with that one. I gotta be careful. It's like, you want the shrimp? I'm gonna have to ask Dave. We've almost got it. Seems like it's finally tired. There's a chance, Dave. We need to end. No, oh, the device! Quickly, grab it, grab it a little faster, Dave! That was close. Look, it's using his last bit of strength. Dave, move that open path for now. We'll be able to hold on much longer. Oh, it's just, it's just a case of staying alive now. Oh my god. Run, Dave. You're so close to freedom. <laughs> Spicy shrimp. <laughs> you you don't want to order this menu item. We're going all the way up the tree. Dead end, what do I do? He's charging. <laughs> it's quick time events now. It's time to become a David Cage game, let's go. We've almost got him. Features entangled in the divine tree. The lucky opportunity to finish it off. Yeah. The drone appears to seems to be malfunctioning. I can't pick up the weapon signal. Mm. What do I do? Is there anything useful around here? Mm. A huge divine tree fruit device over oh. here. The divine tree fruit seems to have returned to normal. If I put it there and operate it, <laughs> too big. I can't possibly move and aim it all by myself. Oh. Oh, they're here to help. Did you bring oxygen? <laughs> we really need it. Are you alright, human? Oh, see, people. Came down here because you didn't come up, even though the divine tree was stabilized. Is that Yaoi? Has it grown that big over this long period of time? So you need to defeat that creature to end this. There's a chance while it's tied up. Let's finish it off. It'll be enough unless we use the divine tree fruit device over here. Given by expertise in both physics and math, it seems like we might be need to adjust the angle of the device upwards. I work with it's incredibly heavy. Help with five of us combine our strengths, we can do it somehow. You bring the divine tree fruit and put it in. There's no time. Just squeezing in extra game mechanics before the end. God, don't have much oxygen. <laughs> Thank you. 
hoping this is it. All right, I'm ready. Vice is spawn, it's time to end our long history. You pesky nuisance, take this. I, I, that's got to do a number on him. He's literally exploded from the light. Oh my god! Oh, that is gruesome! We actually, like, fucking melted him. It was besides what we recovered from that state. It's really been an incredible journey. Did a great job, human. Let's go back to the Sea People Village and talk. But wait, can I get some sushi from it? Oh no, it's not gonna let me. Water temperature is stabilized and divine tree fruit is also in good condition. Villagers who are ill seem to be slowly improving. Based many challenges, but it's a relief that we've managed to overcome. The earthquake on the mainland will stop as well. How about going up and checking the status? Good job, human. Come visit us often. We're just done. We didn't get any sushi. Epilogue friends. Wait, is that it? <laughs> it's immediately just the epilogue. It... Surely there's gotta be like one more scene or something. It's already nighttime. It's been a long day. Go drop by Bancho Sushi. Cobra's not even here. There's nowhere else I can go. Does Dave finally get to eat sushi? Everyone's here. Well, Duff kind of. Hey, there, it. Dave, you're finally back. Everyone's gathered here. Heard from Dr. Bacon, you've accomplished a lot. A good job. How about we all relax today and enjoy some food together? Mm -hmm. Awesome. I was worried I might have to get right back to work. Mm -hmm. We should all celebrate together. Oh, I can I can talk to them. Okay. Hey, Momo. Yeah. Been a while, bunch of sushi. Hey, you, Sammy. You enjoying your life here? Yeah. You know it. There are times I get a bit bored, but it's also incredibly inspiring, yo. Yeah. You saw that recently released Farmer Daddy. Online has been getting great feedback, you know? Still making music, huh? Sure, the sound of hoe hitting the ground, the clucking of a hen, it's all just one big beat to me, yo. Why didn't you come in person? Because I've been waiting for an important parcel today. I've been inspired from afar by your bravery, Dave. The way you fought tirelessly to save the Sea People Village. You were a beautiful girl. I might have joined your fandom. <laughs> I'll pour all my energy to weapon research and prepare for any upcoming crises. As your colleague, I'm counting on your continued efforts, Dave. Alright. It's just as well he's not here in person. Somehow, I still think we can smell him. <laughs> True feast. You're always so busy, you've hardly had the time to chat. That thing's a comma. Plenty of time to share with you some more of my stories. Back in my diving days, I'm mostly in the free dive. Or the necklace my father gave me. The barracudas have a tendency to attack any that shines. No, a school of barracudas came at me. Even worse, I didn't have a harpoon that day. I could flee, might be more dangerous, so I swam straight toward the barracudas. Oh, I think the ground just shook. I didn't feel anything. Dave wants out. Dave, you worked really hard. Gratifying to see your venture prospering. Glad you thanks to you for providing such reliable staff. Must have had your plate full with all kinds of things. Now I hope you can support Bancho and run the restaurant effectively. Bancho's a bit stubborn and might stir up some problems if left to his own devices. Oh, it's the photographer guy as well. Udo's here too. His company's doing well. I can even afford to join these evening gatherings. I can't drink beer. I stick to non-alcoholic drinks though. The hero is helpful, so you don't need the help of reporting anymore, right? Talking about, I still know how to dive. Anything I need help with, I'll come looking for you. Good job, Dave. Only open a shop here because this place has plenty of fish. Who knew it had such a secret? I solved the problem. My business is booming now. So my decision was right after all. Fun experience. Coming here was a good idea. Think about seeking out another adventure. What do you think? Dave the Diver 2. Dive harder. First time I've seen you in the shop. Oh yeah, Ellie's never actually come in person. She's always been over the phone. 
Just finish submitting my paper so I'm a bit free. Oh, I'm glad for you. The ego bag there. I haven't seen it before. Sharp eyes is a reward for maxing out the ego watcher level. A service that prints the face of users committed to environmental protection on a bag. You've been putting a lot of work in since you got some free time. I can't fall behind. That's like a hey. You might want to do the eco watcher missions. Get a bag with Dave on it. Oh, ho. Oh, you made it too. You've been venturing to glaciers to collect uh, Marinka. I thought I'd show some support. Thanks to you, my world ranking keeps getting better and better. Now the big event is behind us. Let's see about gathering the remaining Marinka. Just remember, I forgot to turn off the lights after Giao went to sleep. His Giao is dead. Uh, Envy, thank you for 500 bits earlier. Thank you very much. Ladybug, thank you for 100 bits as well. My fish Ebby is really enjoying this last episode. It's floating right in the tank. Wall that's next to my TV. Bless you. Actual fish is enjoying the sushi game. It's a hell of an endorsement. Still can't believe what happened. Not just the sea people civilization, but the village too. You even solved a crisis. Great job. Now we should keep the civilization secret. You need to maintain the peace they've regained. Oh, Vincent's just here too. Didn't come in to rate your restaurant today, so don't stress, take it easy. By dying in peace, I can savor the intricate flavors more. It's delicious. The prejudices have worn off. There's no denying that there's been a slight change to the taste. Taste change. A bit smoother, you could say. It's softer. Before the dishes were brimming with the chef's strong willed style, now it feels more accommodated to the consumer. Interesting, that translates into the taste as well. Might just be my perception. Sorry, I couldn't be of much help. I was busy with the shop. We talk about Bacho and see people love your cooking. If it's the case, I'm glad. There are no more earthquakes. Let's get to work. Time to serve up a storm. A lot tougher than I thought, but I met a lot of nice people in the end. Looking back, it was a fun adventure. Never would have visited a place like the Sea People Village in my life where I not given the opportunity. Okay, let's relax and go for another exciting dive. Bless you, Dave. Cheers to Dave. Oh, look at them all. Duff, I can't believe Duff is dead. He rest in peace. Here to see the fireworks. Delivery has her. Oh no. <laughs> Duff got his ending. Oh, Dave got a statue. Everyone got to eat lots of sushi. Even Momo gets some time in the spotlight. <laughs> I think Sato is dead. Don't think he made it back. Dave gets the rest tonight. He's living his best life. He gets some feet again at the uh, uh, again right at the end too. Finally, a reward for gameplay. Oh. What just, what just happened? What? Oh, it's the credits. Okay.
I got I gotta blow them open. Let's kill the devs. <laughs> take, can you take them all out? Project manager, you're going away a long time. <laughs> Defeat the game designer. This this is very sweet. get to kill every developer who worked on the game. Love it. I don't take it out of context. <laughs> Local streamer murders game devs. Oh, the, the director is more powerful. Dave the Diver in space. Alien sushi. I'm probably not gonna find all the devs here. I already feel like I'm getting lost and missing ground where they could be. Leaked footage of Dave the Diver too. You were joking about a sequel in space. Uh, of course, this happens. It's here. They already did it. Take them all out. I mean, the end was looking a bit like Alien, so you know, the next logical step is just take it into the upper atmosphere. Dave hungers for more than just sushi. Oh no, I'm missing some devs. Who's hiding? Go up. I'm going up. I don't see him. And you, quickly! They're gonna end! There's a straggler! No, developers escaped! UI artist, take the shot, Dave! <laughs> Thank God. We killed the game developers. I was worried one of them might have got out alive there. Thank you for playing, bless. Their souls have been freed. I was confused by the date. I think that's just the in-game date. That's what it is. Yeah, it's it's not it's not twenty twenty two. Oh, that was, that was wonderful. I've loved this game. So much passion and love in it. Oh, here's some epilogue stuff now, too. <laughs> what happened? Why was there an explosion? I got some sound sleep. Maybe Juno's exploring space. Things should calm down now a bit. Well, then. Making an Eve unfinished business. Let's have a blast running Bancho Sushi. Oh. Why was there a massive explosion? The meteor has struck the ocean. Oh, so you can replay this one. That's cute. There's new stuff in here. Uh, we got everything in the depths. We're missing a big boy here. Unfortunately, that one actually does look a bit like a shark. So we should go at night and maybe capture some more of them. The 
There might be a shark boss. It really looks it. Glacier Passage, we got everything living in there. Glacier Zone, somehow we did not get that much here. Got the jellyfish. Oh, some of them is just for photographing them. So like, we got like the dolphin photo. Hydrothermal vents. We, we almost got a picture of him. <laughs> just seahorses in general. It's like, I've not, I've kind of slacked on these. <laughs> I've not gotten too many. Oh, no. I don't think I'm going to be able to get them all because it's going to take a lot of work. We can try catch some more. Take a few runs, just dedicate to catching fish. We're close though? I would not I don't think we're that close. Mainly because of the seahorses. There's there's a lot there. I mean I wanna have at least one more most profitable day yet. Dan, the giant shark boss. I I Don't do want to fight him. Harvested eggs. Well, that's so many eggs. So many. Yeah, I'm going to harvest just everything. And I'm going to not plant any new for a bit. Just to use it all up. And then we can, like, replant at the same time. I need to fill with high-quality feed. Oh, you gotta pay for it. Only the best for our chickens. Can you ask Cobra to talk about the bomb? Yeah, I'll check in with him. See what's up there. Just toss that down. Oh, I need to actually water these, don't I? <laughs> need to get sprinkler system installed next for like full automation. Yeah, let's go. Let's go a little bit more. Let's go a little bit more. So we haven't. We haven't even been streaming that long yet. It does seem like there's some extra content I like, added in too with this update. Eat the cat. Here you go, Mochi. Find Shark will be the best ending for the series. It <sighs> okay, help me out, chat. Do I need to catch every single thing in the game for the giant shark? No. It's just nocturnal, is it? Some people are saying yes. It's an event. It's a rare nighttime boss. Okay, so I, I need to just catch more stuff in general then, though. Do I? I need a stormy night. No, you just need a stormy night. Okay, we, we have to get it. We we have to we have to beat the giant shark and have our most profitable night yet on, on, in the restaurant. Okay, let's head to the boat. A new products stock. That's fine. Taking may have stopped, but we're still reeling in a variety from the blue hole. Get back to business without a care in the world. Is it like Marin season as well or something because of these? With the new party coming up? A well, Marlin party even. I haven't seen any Marlins, I don't think. 
Where are these guys? Okay, blue hole depths is done. Alright, it's gonna be a big help me out chat. Um, we're gonna try and document as much as we possibly can. It's gonna t it's gonna take a while. Marilyn in the sha shallows. Okay, I think that's it there. Yeah. There's a kind of shark we don't have yet. Excuse me. Where have you been? Where the fuck have you been? Do I need to catch him as like three star quality? Does does it matter on the quality? I think it just determines if you get a gold card. No, but it's shiny. Okay. Uh, I'll just take my tranquilizer rifle for now. That, uh, that's just good for getting some of the big sharks. What do you need for the eco watch stuff? Uh, everything. <laughs> okay, we're going in. Okay, I'm gonna need chat's help figuring out what we do and don't have. Because it, it really could be anything. Like, I did not have that. It didn't have that. Like, even these ones right at the surface, I've never caught them. Uh, sort by unattained. Oh god. Okay, we're staying in the shallows a while. We've got we've got the tuna. I don't think I even have this one. No, I don't. And I miss so many. We're not even that far in. I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to catch everything, aren't I? Never caught any of these basic ass fish. Tuna, please. You knew. So lemon porgy. Okay, there. All right, we need this one. God! He's angry. Okay, pick him up. That's a new one too. Yeah, that's great. We have him documented now. And packaged for, for the event. We're gonna have to toss out a few loads of fish as we go here. More than likely. Oh, jeez! So, this guy got nerfed because he was too strong. He does less damage now. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. Let him on. So ungodly strong. What don't I have here? It's so hard to tell. Maybe you? I 
think I got that one now. Wiped out an entire family. I have this pink one. I have this one. Just got a. We just got a harpoon at all. I think I have one of the eels. Definitely have a dory. I, I'm pretty sure I have an eel. so many catfish. Necessary. You can only catch the eels at night, I think. I'm pretty sure I have one, though, so I think we're okay. I just caught that one. I'm over there. I'll get it. Flush there. Assemble up parts. Come on. If I go down here, am I, I'm not in the shallows anymore, am I? Is this the point I leave the shallows? Shallows is zero to 50. Okay, so we need to go back up and search. Are you new? The wildlife is going to suffer today. <laughs> How do you see what Duff can really do? You have to upgrade to the death rifle. Oh god. We'll get it eventually. Need the decks again. There are currently six fish. There is a shrimp in there too. Uh, normal blog, thank you for a thousand bits. Hey Dan, I'm a welder and one of the parts I weld is a small tube with several holes in it called a roller tube or an RT for short. I found one with no holes in it. I named it Daniel because it's an holy RT. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, it's very sweet. Pretty sure I got this guy. Oh, that's just a manta ray. Pretty sure I have one of you, though. Take him out anyway, just to be sure. Yep, yeah, we have... It's Stingray, we have you. Ocean Pancake has been defeated. Do I have that pink one? I think I got a few of them already today. Do I have you? Oh, he's chomping. Yep. Have one of him. We're not even looking to harvest him or anything. It's just like, can we document you? Am I up for any shrimp? They're gonna be higher to spot. Yeah, we definitely have you. The boat wreck is in the shallows, isn't it? 
Um, no, no, I don't think, I think that's further down than the shallows. Did I pick this up? This is just worse. Uh. Have you get get out of here? You're not that important. You fish are just going to die today. <laughs> Do I have one of you? Shank him down. There's something under the rock here. This is moving. How do I how do I break that open? There might be something in there. You need a shovel. Shovel or a bomb, okay. Is there anything down by the shark? This is just a regular shark at this point. We don't we don't even need you. Maybe so. To the right near the wall. I I have him, don't I? I think I have this guy. Caught him at the start. Yep, we got him. Surely there must be a better way to collect it, cook ingredients and find them in the ocean. Well, I've hired restaurant staff now specifically to go to the shops. To save us some trips. Just picking up a bunch of veg while we're down here too, because we need that. It's this guy. This long boy. There is a shark of some kind. Some fish. Circular boy. Small boy. Are they nocturnal? The nocturnal ones have their own category. I think. See? Nocturnal, see? They have their own category. We're missing a lot of nocturnal ones. Medium depth. Okay, maybe we just maybe we just keep going to medium depth. Shipwreck interior. It does say it. There's one in shipwreck interior. Okay, let's go down for that then. And then I'll see if I get a shovel to break that rock. There's one in there. Gonna be one of the longest dives. I, th I, I no, I think this will be the longest dive we've ever done. Because we're specifically trying to find as many fish as possible to document. Okay, right, now that I'm in medium depth, we've got five fish. We won the shipwreck. So let's go get the shipwreck fish. I think these ones are all just fish, yeah. There's nothing too remarkable about any of them. I'm amazed the sharks ended up being the least intimidating thing in the game. 
That was just par for the course. It's kind of hilarious, ain't it? We fought them so much. We now just deal with them. Can the shipwreck be in uh, that cave? I thought it was outside of the cave. We catch any seahorse we find too. No, it can't be in the cave. Okay. Good to know. Let's just be below the cave. Catch as many shrimp as possible. Coral trout. Get one of you. I did. Catch you. Getting the seahorses. Get you. We're gonna have to discard half the fish later, too. Some of them might be photo spots, which we're not gonna see for a while. It's, it's really amazing how little your carry weight fills up when you're hunting something other than sharks. <laughs> I've not experienced this most of the game. Oh, speaking of, he heard me. What was the time when you were the most valuable shark on the menu? Don't even need them now. Tom says that the game is designed for a variety of murder. No, no. Surely not. for profit now he kills for fun I'm just having a good time come on this is some recreational murder you know I don't want murdering to take up all the time on the day job, you know, because then I'm, I'm not going to enjoy it as much if I do that. I do the old part-time murder now. Knocked about. Definitely have this jellyfish. Would it say if they're caught only in here? Shipwreck interior. Shipwreck interior. Stalactite cave. Okay, so they're, they're not in there. No, oh, does it treat it as a new area? Quickly check. Over here. Have a quick old look. I think actually all the fish that I can see here we've caught. Darky boy just hanging out. I 
Dan, what's your thoughts on the Minecraft mob vote revolution that's been happening in the community? Uh, revolution? I don't know what revolution means. Like, like in this context. I saw, I saw, like, the mob vote and that. Um, I, I kind of want the penguin to get in. People desire all three, but they're not, they're not doing all three. It takes development time and resources. Getting angry they all don't, all don't get in. But like, just because one loses the vote doesn't mean it might not get in later. Like, they may they may just revisit it. It's like, actually, we like that design. It just guarantees what the next one is, you know? Seems silly. They said they won't, and they might change their mind. Who knows? Oh, Zebra. I think they're just trying to keep, like, adding mobs to Minecraft, like, you know, kind of special. They don't want to add too many at once. It's just a fun, harmless thing, I thought. I, di I didn't realize it, like, people, people were getting so heated. Yeah, just install a mod if you want a mod. Pretty sure, like, the, the penguins definitely are already a moddable thing for Minecraft. Manic mackerel. Okay, oh, we're searching. Okay, so not down that far. That's 130. That's the limit. Maybe. Oh, you're just shrimp. The main complaint is that the developers being lazy and not adding so much to the game. Uh, with Minecraft, though, it's always a hard thing, I feel. Because you don't want to add too much. Because, uh, to be honest, like, speaking as like an old gamer, for Minecraft, like, I'm kind of overwhelmed with the amount of new systems in that. I'm, it's cool that it's there. But there's, like, a pureness almost with that game. With, like, structures and blocks and how one thing leads to the next. But I imagine it's quite a difficult line to walk, you know? It seems weird to get heated, though, over a, you know... Just it's like, hey, we're gonna put a penguin in the game. The kind of you know, fun little mob vote then. Anything else? Anyway, vote. I'm, I'll cast a vote for penguin at some point. I think people might be thinking too hard about it. How oh, is the wizard hat one? It's a fish mod. You just teleport. Where? Where'd he go? Uh, how am I supposed to get this? I'm gonna need a longer range weapon. Yeah, I don't think I can. You mentioned a sniper rifle. Yeah, I think I'm gonna need it. Let, let him go for now. I don't need a shovel. It's a ahead of time you need the sniper rifle. Ah, well, I guess I just can't read. Oh well. 
It's fine. New seahorse cat. I'm gradually find stuff. Are you the new shark? No, you're just you're just a hammerhead. You're just a hammerhead. They're not e they're not even valuable anymore. You were just a hammerhead shark. Get out of my face. Got you. I definitely got you. There's a sharky boy. All the crabs. Okay, there's there's one here. Hang on. I think I already have a crab. Yeah, I already I already have a crab or something. There he is. Don't need you. Oh, I need you though. Okay, you're new. Gotta gotta get through the fish here. Have you? Atlantic mackerel. Let's yeah, just let's pack him up. I'm just gonna get him out of the way just because he's a big lad. That was a smooth hammerhead, was it? Do I not have that? Or was it just because, like, I brought him in alive? I think it's because I brought him in alive. Okay. It's different if it's alive. Personally, for, like, for, like Minecraft mob votes uh, these days, like... As someone who's probably, like, spends more time with just, like, building little Minecraft Lego sets and that. I just want a cute little Lego penguin. <laughs> That's my thoughts. Those have just been very relaxing. To just put together every now and then. And not too many, because too many would ruin the fun. nothing else in here. Um, I'm guessing that some of them are just not going to spawn at this time of day too. And maybe I have to come back in the afternoon. Or like just cycle the spawns. God, he's really got it in for me. I need to find a shovel still. I'm, I'm not able to get him today. Okay, just let him exist. Uh, blue hole depths. I have every single fish in here. That one's done. Nocturnal can't do right now. Uh, the Glacier Passage. Have them all. Glacier Zone. And then there's one in the vents. That's the picture. And the rest are just seahorse. Here's all the fishmon that you can get to. Okay, so let's make our way down to the Glacier Zone. Because I think I need to just cycle the spawns. I don't think I can find any more right now. Uh, let me 
just use that, sure. Just make my way down. If I find a shovel, we can go back and get something. Two. Enhanced ice gun. We've never seen this. Little shard of ice. Let's try it out. Pickaxe. Would the pickaxe work? No, the pickaxe works. Look, basic ass shark. Don't eat him. Oh no, I already have everything here. There's no reason for me to be attacking you. Led astray by the shovel. That's what we need, isn't it? You can check in here. Have you got anything for us? You're just hanging out. Speaking of the mob vote, I'm still tempted for some day. Now, obviously won't do this for a while because we, we even had, um, you know, of course, WW me. The incredible competition to decide like a future game to be played. I am tempted, though, at some point just to try play regular Minecraft again. Because I'd I, like, when last time I actually played like normal ass Minecraft, like horses were new. Like, that's when I dipped out. So like that's like a, like seven years ago or something ridiculous. And it, it just seems like there's a shitload of new stuff ever since. So like, that, that's what maybe it might be fun at some point to check it out again. The distant future. Gotta wait for like a full 10 years. It's like maybe 2025. What what year were horses at it? How old am I? <laughs> they were at it in 2013? Oh shit, okay. Oh god! So I, I like I, that's the thing. I've not played it properly in a long ass time. July 2013. Acronis, thank you for the thousand bits there. Hey Dan, send this message from the Comic Con show floor. I got to meet the voice actor for Ryuji, and I asked him to sign something the way Ryuji would. He wrote for real. Yo, what's bonkin'? <laughs> That's great. Can't believe you met Philbo from Bug Snacks. Yeah. This is a real takeaway. Oh shit, there's a quest! What? What is this? Jesus added horses to the game thousands of years ago. Shaking my head, lazy dev, no updates. <laughs> Damn. 
Wait, is this me? This statue of me in the Sea People Village feels kind of nice, to be honest. Oh, look at you, Dave. That's a really cute statue. Love it. He's so rotund. Yeah, he's so round. Finally, some respect for Dave. Oh, Dua's, Dua's getting really sick. Trish's food for sea people. Keeps falling ill. Seed shop. Oh, there's some new stuff here. Look at all this. Buy some of that. Get one of everything. What else are we going to spend this currency on? Seaweed farm. Oh, look at the manatee friends helping out. No, he lost his cart! No, Mr. Manatee. He's gotta catch it. Look at him go. He's working so hard. <laughs> Not quite. Picked up all this. Uh, harvest the Antarctic ones. We need a more of that. Black coral. Seaweed. Let's just throw them in too. I need to go to the restaurant for something. Do some gambling for its own sake. His carrot is loose. Maybe that's a bug from the from the update. I don't think his carrot is supposed to be that loose. Like run away from him. He seems to be on like a different cycle. Okay, food for coughs. Horsehair crabs are good for coughs. Problems is they dwell in the glacial area and live in crevices between rocks. You reckon either catch them to disappear as the path of the glacial area got blocked off. Oh, I gotta go out. Okay, so that's gonna be... That's gonna be something that we're missing, too. We need to pick that up. Uh, I need to just go to the glacial area for now and just see what I can pick up in general. Okay, so, this is Glacier Zone, sort by unobtained. It's a mean looking crab. First glacial cave, glacial area, third glacial cave. Okay, so they're in specific spots in this area. That, that makes it significantly easier. First glacial cave and the third glacial cave. I don't I don't need to bother with anything else here. There's the sniper rifle. I want to go all the way back to the wizard one. I don't think I do. Okay, so first glacial cave was over to the right. I don't need to bother with any of these other fish. I need to see if I can get a picture of the seal account again. I know where he is. Should be over here. I love the music in this game. Yeah, it's really good. Me too. this anymore. So what am I missing? Uh, first glacial cave, there's three fish in here.
Am I gonna have to solve the puzzles again, or? I think that's just unlocked. Just really ignored every possible fish I could the entire game. <laughs> Anyone see fish? Have to go back this way a bit. Ah, this might be them. I wonder. I really just ignored them. But I think it's just these basic ass fish. Yeah, there's three of them here. Come on. Come on. Last Pollock. Okay, somehow got that one. He must appear in another region somewhere. Arctic Cod. What about this dude? Arctic telescope fish. Come on. Don't know if I have him. See, we can we can actually see by the silhouette now. We've got enough of them. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's looking a bit different. The last one. Oh, it, it tells you if it's a photo op fish too. You can actually see that. Giant eyes of body. Yeah, I thought it might have been. I only know that from Animal Crossing. <laughs> there he is. Oh, look at him. No, oh, it's it's a Batty Nomus. Rare encounter. They have defeated a shark. Take a picture of three at once. They love shark sushi. <laughs> okay, uh, now we need to go down to the third cave. And then I need to try and take a picture of the other one. I'm hoping this, like, triggers something with, like, the Marika card guy. And we need a stormy night for the mega shark. Yeah, we, we can't, I really want to fight him to end it. It just feels right. Dave defeats the biggest shark of all. Back up here. They made fish from Animal Crossing real. It does feel that way sometimes. I got a sea bass. That's a C plus. Here's more of the rocks. Okay, so... Right, so catching these is going to be related to that quest. Yeah, that, that, that must be the hermit crab. It was not just a shovel. You gotta talk to Otto for it. They're down here too. It's the same kind of setup. Thank God we found some mail. Oh! Yeah, let's see if we can freeze him.
Okay, it actually just freezes him. It doesn't seem to do any damage after he's frozen, though. But it does extra once you crack him open. Pretty good. I have to drop something. Uh, what have I got, like, two of? There's, there's so much stuff in my inventory. I need the sailfish. Don't need two of you. So many Trevallis. Big ice guy. I have a puffer fish. I need to discard ones to actually make an impact with like the weight, too. Definitely have all of you. Okay, let's dive down to the bottom and get the photo, and then we can go to the cave. Imagine dying to freeze when you live in the Arctic zone. <laughs> it's pretty devastating. Oh god. I'm actually, I'm actually not looking to pick a fight with you today, mister. Please don't attack me. Uh, I'm just gonna grab the picture. Okay, I'll do. Udo will like this. Yes, he will. Dave, we gotta go. Dip into here real quick. Is there anything else to get down here? The shrimp meat. Oh shit, do, do we not have it already? How, how, how do I um, get down to him again? Do I have to go all the way around? Bottom right. It is these big boys again. Through here? You guys sure? I don't remember this being the right way. My god, he's gonna kill me. Oh no, it is just back here, okay. Freeze him. Oh, we're gonna have a feast tonight. Just get out of my way, sir. There's, there's no reason for you to be doing this. Capture him while we're at it. You can carve him up. Oh, he's inner flesh. That's gonna be except for some good sushi. Can't go in there. I know I say this quite often, but I think this is gonna be our most profitable night yet, gang. <laughs> Very high chance. Profits are gonna be soaring. Every night is our most profitable night because we are an exceptional business.
We're gonna have to solve this bit of it to get back out. Come on. Be free, snail. These guys are valuable, but they're light, so I can just pilfer a few. <laughs> I feel like they should be, because they're, they're in like the final area of the game. Okay, we gotta go to the side cave. See what we can pick up there. And then we can head on home. Not optimal gameplay. <laughs> it's fine. Look, we're we're beating the game, right? <laughs> this is terrible, Dan. We've already done the thing. <laughs> oh, get out of here! Get. Go away, please. This is not your battle. Come on, go away. I want the oxygen. He's like camping over. Thank you. Okay, so we just need two fish in here. And, like, that's it for now. Uh, these ones probably are just, like, the basic-ass fish right at the start. Okay, no, it's a long boy and then a round boy. Long boy and round boy. I think that's long boy. No, it's not. Need to drop this fella. Drop him too. Is that the round boy up there? That might be a round boy. Come on. Come on. It's so tough down here. Okay, lump fish. Then we need a long boy. That's not him, is it? No. Not the right silhouette. He needs to be extra long. Shade pedestal. The cannot see by humans. The sea people seem to have used the divine tree as a source of light. Did I not see any of them earlier? There's the long boy. Extra long. Come on. That's a rare spawn you got. Okay. Snub nose spiny eel. Got it. Don't discard his flesh. That that's gonna be the most valuable thing we've ever cooked. Yeah, I'll discard a single shark meat. So I can get back out. Illegal <laughs> You can't do this to me. Be 
fine, guys. Poor Beagle Shark actually has the distinction of being one of the few sharks that are part of a dish. Oh, so you're telling me I really shouldn't have thrown that away. <laughs> I missed the old RT game, he would have never thrown away Shark. God damn it. I'm just gonna rush back up. God. I'm hoping with all of that, like, the card guy's like, oh shit, there's a rare one. Or, like, a stormy night just instantly happens or something. But I think it, I, I can't tell if it was related to it being a stormy night or not before. For the rare spawn. Okay, go back to the boat. Uh, now I need to search the shallows and the depths again for fish. Uh, just, yeah, just cook all these as well. <laughs> oh my god, we got a lot. The fish tank is gonna be overwhelmed after this run. Yuck, it's gross. So bug. I remember often seeing it in my backyard. Take this picture at my place. <laughs> it says there's a dead shark in the picture. Is this my back garden? Yeah. Okay, we, we, we got him. <laughs> Coelacanth. Living fossil barely changed with the Paleozoic era. So when the Paleozoic era I actually saw it in person, so I could be sure it's the same. This is what you call an inconvenient truth. <laughs> Picture is going to make waves. Yeah. <laughs> hey, more photo spots get. <laughs> crops have all grown. I'm gonna just wait on the crops. I want them. I want more of them to grow. Let me just harvest them all. Hey, look at our card completion rank go up. Glacier zone. We're literally just missing a crab. Oh, I need to talk to Otto. Yeah, actually, I do. I might as well get the crops here. My soil is so bad. Half the crops are dying before they even, like, make it to harvest. You want to catch a horse aircraft? You need a crab trap. <laughs> Put some bait inside the crab trap, place it between some rocks, and the crabs or lobsters walk right in. Do you have any? I'm tired? Of course I don't have one. I can make one for you if you have the materials. Lumber, scrap iron, rope, and you need a tiger shark too for a good grip. E Excellent! I have some handy tiger shark teeth in my pocket. I have like a full necklace of them. To be honest, like the, the amount we've killed. Be kind of shocked if he didn't have it. Oh, look at him go. <laughs> it's done. Oh, sweet. I can put, like, this is like a nice rabbit hutch. Put in the crevasse with lots of bubbles and wait for a bit. <laughs> Catch the crab. The crab trap will start shaking. You'll know right away. Different things live in different areas, so try to put that to good use. Cool. So we can now just use that while we're off on our adventure. Uh, okay, let's just head back down. I, this is going to be another long dive day. Fix your crops, save them. No, I'm, I'm waiting for them all to just like grow or like die. And then, uh... I can start a new harvest all at once. Because at the moment it's like, hey, something new is growing like every single time. Because I've just planted them whenever.
Remember the Barrett 50 cal, Dad? Oh. Uh, well, we, we have time for the jellyfish wizard. We have time for him. We'll get him later. We might actually need the tranquilizer rifle. We encounter, like, the big shark. No, you don't. It's Sunday. This is the last time. Uh, all right, all right. Everyone, everyone, everyone can calm down now. Let me see if I can even upgrade the sniper rifle. I can make it red. Let's make it red. Duff's giving it his all once again. <laughs> God, he scares me. I need giant Trevally fins for that one. I need giant Trevally fins for all the basic ones. Okay, um, do I want to just use one of these maybe as well? Maybe I can get something with it. Okay. Uh, dive back in. What are we looking for? It really is. We're doing our be like slightly completionist run to try and get some of these. I want this shark to appear. I don't know where he is. I'm hoping for a stormy night by doing this. Okay, and I have what I need for the crabs. Go on a little journey. Still need the Marilyns too for Marilyn Knight. I don't know if we even get the Marilyn Knight, to be honest. I don't know if we need to. Might be doing good enough. Oh, he's so much slower. They they really nerfed him. Because he's still quite strong. But he's absolutely been nerfed. He's just slower now. Okay, is it just slower? Big belly seahorse, I'll take it. Are you new? White like shrimp, you are? That's pretty good. Two new ones right off the bat. Catch all these lads. They're gonna all be cooked. Okay, so what's here? Uh, sort by unattained. Okay, massive shark. It's the other shapes we need to keep an eye out for. And... Unfortunately, they're all a bit fish-like. I know it sounds stupid to say, but you know what I mean. They're very fish-like, so they're gonna be they're gonna be harder to get. Oh, also, I'm incredibly injured. Got you. 
Let me know if you see one that might be one of those ones we're, we're missing. It's gonna be really hard to spot. Unfortunately. There's another Marilyn. I, I wanna get oxygen before I fight him. See bubbles from the crevasse. Place the crab trap. So this this will be one of them. Bait in the trap and place it in certain rocky crevasses. By catching the crab, the crab trap will start shaking. Oh, you can catch like a few in one go. Or unretrieve crab traps disappear when you leave the water. Make sure you retrieve them. Oh, I'm only gonna have one per run. Uh, what what's the best bait? He's higher grade bait. Do I just pop a piece of shark and put him in? Come back later. Take some time until something takes the bait. How lo how long do I have to wait? They love shark, just like you. I, I need to get this oxygen real quick. Hang on. Oh my god. Significantly harder without my standard just gun him down uh, rifle. Can't really use the sniper rifle yet because I have to catch the wizard. There we go. Can't tell if I have these fish or not too around me. I have you? I feel like I do. Has it already caught some? Do I, do I leave it longer, or do I just pick it up now? That was quick. Tell me out here, chat. I don't know. Leave it longer. You leave it, you get more. Okay. Alright, we'll come, we'll come back at the end, then. You knew? No. I already caught you. Leave it till you're leaving. I, I, I will. Okay, we'll just do uh, the depths now. I won't go to the glacier area this this run. If I do that, uh, it'll, it'll despawn. Don't forget. RT, look behind you. Whoa! You got me. Why is this game still introducing mechanics this late into the game? I mean, it, I, I think I think this time specifically, it's just because like, they patched it in. <laughs> No, th th this is apparently just like brand new to the game. So we'd actually be done the glacier area already now if it wasn't for the, like the, this update just there. <laughs> Yo, uh, we still we still need these fish. Search over to the left a bit. Coming for the DLC where Dave goes to space. Sushi, thanks for having your bits. Uh, actually, that, that's already happened. I, 
I don't know if you if you caught that bit of the stream, but we actually did go to space earlier. So they uh, they they beat you to it. It's already been done. See this ending in here. I'm trying to think of it's just like more unusual spots where maybe there's a new fish. Maybe. Maybe they just not spawn in for some other conditions. Like, maybe it has to be a special event like the Marilyn. And they're just not here yet. Could be that. Okay, depths. Um... They're, they're all just fish. <laughs> they're all... It's hard to distinguish them. One looks a bit like a catfish, it does. So maybe a catfish. Just fish. Do you? No. So many of you. Fish. Mackerel get. Another day, another shark. I didn't see any tuna this time. Which is not about. Oh, the radar's going off. Hang on. That's a chance to capture it. Fish cat. I can, I can abandon this, like, sniper rifle now. Hammerhead boy. I'm, I'm gonna be scouring the ocean forever to try and get them out. I don't think we're gonna be able to do it. It does seem a little torturous to try and find it. So those are just the random spawns. Oh, run, Dave, run. Wait, is that one of them? No. <laughs> no, I, I, I probably caught like 500 of them. Some fish only spawn in certain map variations. There's a pink one just there. Which one? I'm not seeing a pink one. Just ignore the shark. Have him. To the right now. This one? I, I already have him. I already have him too. But we, we've duped the shark as well. To the left, take it back right now. <laughs> oh no. Let's, let's just head back. Get our crab trap. Maybe there's one that will spawn in the limestone cave again too. This is like the like different area. All 
Well, actually, it probably says if it's limestone cave, doesn't it? Probably is none here. The chat is currently performing the cha cha slide. <laughs> God love you. Having a great time. Let me, let me get the crab trap back. Shark, shark, slide. I don't, I don't even think he's worth anything anymore. That one? No. Like 50 of them. Get out of here. That poor hammerhead's self-esteem is in tatters. <laughs> like, oh man, he doesn't even want to kill me anymore. <laughs> oh gee, he used to always be excited to see me. I've caught so many of them. I keep thinking it's new every time. Okay, let's open it up. European and American lobster. Were those even on the classifications? No, they're, they're not here. Oh, there's a new one just for crab traps. Okay. Why, why is this one here, though? Is that just like a different spawn that I, I need to keep an eye out for? Doesn't say it's a crab trap. He's separate. I, th I thought that would have been him. It's the one you bash with a rock. Okay. Don't worry, that one's just less humane. Okay, let's, let's just dive, hop back up. Uh, cook him up. It's not a stormy night as well. Okay, here's your fish man. Uh, I do need to go nighttime diving though. There's a shitload of them to collect at night. That we sit, we uh, we absolutely just don't have these. Let's go go get some of the fish. So it's I need a stormy night for this guy. Yeah, he's even kind of in the same category because these two are the other stormy night ones. There's not a way for me to make sure it's a stormy night, is there? You can always skip time. I I could just start skipping time a lot, yeah. I don't think I'm too fussed if I start doing that. Check the weather app. Oh, of course. Okay, it's just it's just sunny for eight forever. It's just sunny. <laughs> yeah, we, we might end up skipping a bit of time. I think that's because the party's on Tuesday night. So maybe after that. That's the last party, see? Okay. Uh, we're not gonna focus too hard on profits tonight. We need to, we need to get a few more sh fish documented. It's time, time to capture everything. 
already knew. Like, we literally just hopped in the ocean. Shows how little we have. Just harvesting all these as I see them, too. Uh, let's sort it by nocturnal. I think even this guy, like, I, I just don't have him. The lionfish, look at that. Evil Dan be like, we will not focus on profits. <laughs> like, oh, something's wrong with this guy. <laughs> It's not, this is not my streamer. Uh, get some of you. I think we have plenty of them, man. Take him in one go. Okay, so already there's only three left. Jesus. That was so quick. One of them at 0 to 50. And then 50 to 130. So we're looking for this silhouette. Keep an eye out for this fishy boy. That's a shark, is it? Shit, he is a lot bigger. It's a zebra shark? Am I just looking for a stripey boy? Oh my god, he's there! It's him! Oh, he's so cute! I feel bad murdering him. But I will still murder him. Because I want to turn him into sushi. I should have brought the tranquilizer rifle. Oh, he's amazing. Yeah, just, just haul his body back. Small net gun if I want. Okay, there's only there's only one more then. Well two more uh, and I gotta go to fifty next. And we go. Hopefully the Pokemon guy notices our hard work and it's like it just triggers a stormy night sooner. That's one of them. Okay, we're looking for a long, snaky boy. Not yourself. Long, snaky boy, there he is. Blackfin Barracuda. Okay, that's uh, that's Nocturnal just completely done. That one's 100%. Pretty good. We're just missing some that are like in the shallows and like the- We're still missing some of the starting area. But I guess we're just gonna have to cycle it. A lot and just kind of check each day. I can check for like the lobsters and stuff, but I, considering the considering the lobsters have just been added, do you think? Oh no, but they added the 100% completion thing with the lobsters, didn't they? So if you want that, you have to actually get all the lobsters, probably. 
Oh god, that's really gonna take a while. Okay, we're not we're not we're not aiming for hundred percent then. There's no way. Especially with like the lobster lottery that we have to play. Pop this down. Uh, rank. I have a nice piece of shrimp. I'm hoping that'll be enough. Can I just wait here? Or do I have to go away? I think it takes like 50 hours for 100% completion looking it up. You scare them off if you're just there. What if I just stay here? Boo. I guess I just sit tight a while. Go get some sharks. I, I guess. You're not going to be able to do much else. As they say, a watched crab pot never boils. <laughs> Have some nice chill time. I already caught one there, see? We love seeing you murder sharks. Don't sound so disappointed. Dave, Dave is just having a bit of a rough time. <laughs> I need to get more of the traps in, yeah. I'd probably fear the man who gets attacked by sharks every day. The average is 46 hours to 100%. Okay. We probably, we probably won't worry too much about 100% then. And we'll just try and get like our shark super boss. Maybe if they update the game, like, later down the road, then, like, we can look at 100% again. They update it again, like, there's even more stuff to do. I'm genuinely shocked there's not going to be, like, DLC or something for this game. Feels like they could do it. Just Dave goes to a new place. That's all you need. The shark super bosses are 100%. It is. What we deserve. Oh, I was about to dive back all the way, and then I realized, hang on, we need to collect the trap. Now let me... Let me just quickly journey back. We just have to kind of wait around a while. came as well during the Game Awards. Yeah, I, I, I'd be surprised if it didn't get some. It's genuinely really good. It's like, a, uh, just the humor and charm of it. Like, you can tell a lot of love went into it. Crystal Lobster and the Fan Lobster. I'll take him. Swim on back. Excuse me. There we go. 
Maybe a new biome or something. Yeah, like, they, they, they could do... There's a lot of ways you could add more content to the game. Just some new places to go. Fish to catch. Seems like it'd be pretty doable. Send all them off. Uh, well, it is certainly going to be a night at the sushi restaurant. Not the most profitable, but we're not aiming for that. Who's this? Oh wait, there's still VIPs, is there? Django, huh? Something wrong. Cold, it's too cold. This average is at 27 degrees Celsius even during the evening. Nobody is aching, I'll freeze to death. Is there anywhere I can plant some seeds? Seeds. I'm in a snowy mountain of some faraway country. A local cooked me a meal with some peppers. Warm me up, I could conserve my heart, I mean my health. I was able to reach the top thanks to that dish. Local gave me some pepper seeds here. My friends used to love this song, it was inspired by hot pepper tuna. He said just listening to the song warms him up. Can you cook me some hot pepper tuna, please? I don't know what the ing ingredients are, but I'm sure that dish will warm me up. Okay, we got we gotta help him out before he like dies of hypothermia. Is he made with pepper? This pepper seed to auto. This time you wrote the song hot pepper tuna, you might know something about it. I talk to them first. Oh, jeez, everything is happening tonight. Alex the Fish Fryer. <laughs> oh, they're, they're doing a new episode of the show. What? Previous episode of Challenge the Chef was as hot as molten lava. It was truly an interesting development. Today's episode, a new challenger appears. Let me introduce you to Alex Cooper Cooks as Platinum Ranked Chef from the United Kingdom. Oh, you're going down. You must be the sushi chef who beat uh, Wang Pang in the last competition, yes? I expect a fancier restaurant than this. Your establishment is humble indeed. The challenge is provoking the champion is being exciting to match. Today's theme is Fry to Sea. In Japan, the United Kingdom are popular for their fried dishes. Which may look similar, but they are authentic each in their own way. Whose dish will please the palate of Vincent the Judge? Can you guess the winner? I was watered already. I'll give you two days. Oh, we're gonna destroy him. This is just unnecessary. It's an easy one this time. Your fried sea bream or a black tiger shrimp will win the day easily. My choice is deep sea fish. Your well known recipes, I just don't want to replicate the taste. Pick up the kitchen knife to explore new ingredients and taste of the sea. Flesh of deep sea fish is usually soft and gelatinous. I will fry it and harden it to add flavor and texture. Bancho's going all in. Cookie cutter shark, vampire squid, and binocular fish. I I think I have everything already. This fried food is the best. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Amazing. Shopping is done. Seven hundred and fifty. We can't cook this tonight, because it's not going to be our most profitable night. We're going to save it. We're going to sa save it with a night with this and vegetable sushi. That's my plan. Get this Dunklesaurus enhanced. What do you even need money for now? There's still some upgrades I can get. I can like upgrade the farm, I can train staff. If I train the staff more, I can make even more money. And then earn more money to upgrade the staff more and make more money. Oh my god, this, this is going to be worth a lot. This is going to be worth a lot. Jesus Christ. Upgrade it. Hammer add meat, just upgrade it. 608. I can just make this. It's a very simple upgrade, but 
can actually afford it a few times. Might not be a bad one to get. You upgrade the fish farms at all? Um, no, I really haven't. 32 Maryland meat. Need them for that. I, I need a lot of miso and garlic. I, I gotta invest it all in garlic and get the gang out to just gather miso. They're currently collecting mayonnaise. And you also need more, significantly more carrots for this. I can make a shitload off of this. Oh my god. The vegetable sushi is almost as good as the, the max level final boss meat. It's insane. It's so powerful. Okay, today is just a uh, Greenland shark night. No, no, I I need to say I need to save the good stuff. Tonight is simply a shark night. We don't. We save our best. We save our best. We have the lesser sharks. We're just gonna serve them up. Make narwhal sushi. God, that that sounds just monstrous. And use up some of the tuna. I might need some. Okay, that that's fine. That that's all we need on the menu tonight. Okay. Get going, gang. Pretty sure to her loss and you can't eat narwhal. Not in this country. <laughs> Wherever Dave is located. So just don't worry about it. My staff is just gonna keep serving it up. Some space. Not gonna be as many tonight, but that's fine. Not trying to maximize profits this night. Just trying to make it passable. Just a calm night. We still made ten grand too. So you know it it's still pretty good. like our day off for profits. <laughs> God, it's so little in comparison to what came before. <laughs> okay, we're gonna bounce back though. We're gonna bounce back. Maryland night is coming up. We're gonna have so many. Okay, hey, Sammy's got something. I'll discuss some way you can come to the chicken farm. Penny for Sammy's thoughts. A wonderful Monday. The magazine is through the roof. Yeah, I need to grow, what was it, a shitload of garlic, wasn't it? I also need to sort out the pepper seeds. Hey, what's wrong, Sammy? Prepare my new album. I haven't done any live shows. Bit short in cash. I'd like to help help you run your farm as a part timer. What do you think? Yeah. Help you harvest crops, sow seeds, and weed, and fertilize your field. Yeah. Oh shit! I can just pay him. Work it off, If you ever need an extra hand, you can even decide how many days you want me to work at your farm. <laughs> I can automate it. Sammy will just do it. You can hire Sammy to work on your farm. Sammy can have his crops, sow seeds, and fertilize and weed fields. Sammy will take care of your seeds and fertilize you. It will make farm much easier. You can decide how to use fertilize and the type of seed to plant. Shit, that's, that's pretty good. We might just want that. Industrialize. Like 
we must expand. Oh, I got some habanero seeds. If spiciest pepper in the world, can't even harvest it by wearing gloves. It'd be difficult to grow here. Yeah, yeah we got we got a customer who needs this. Yeah, yeah. Oh, pepper tuna. The song was inspired by a dish my mom would sometimes cook for me. Mom's pepper dish, especially a pepper tuna. It was the best. <laughs> I still remember Sammy drenched in sweat, gobbled up every last bit. And the entire next day in the toilet that he would eat it again. Oh my god. <laughs> you just got the shits. I was like, oh, this is really good though. Okay, recipe unlocked. Okay, so what do I need? Um. Food-wise, it's just- I just need garlic for the Maryland, don't I? That's the main thing. I could just- I could just buy garlic. No, I should grow it. It's cheaper. I need to expand this as well if I can. Harvest up. Carrot? I need carrots as well for vegetable sushi, don't I? Carrot, garlic. I want to expand the field even further. Higher. Three day period. I'm gonna harvest, fertilize, sow seeds, and weed the field. So we need seeds. You can change when to use fertilizer. Okay, grow the garlic, Sammy. Grow, grow all of that. Here's your harvest up fertilizer. So there's now just a manage option for him. Okay. Uh, maybe I should get... Should I give him more seeds? Maybe give him some more fertilizer? space in the menu. Sa Sammy's got everything already. Okay, Sammy's gonna just get to work. I, I trust him. What's this? Oh, that's just extra seats. Okay, they just get put there. There's no space uh, in Sammy's inventory right now for more. All right, let's try that. Did you change your mic? Uh, I don't think so. It should sound the same. The same mic. God, this fucking. <laughs> what has happened in here? <laughs> We need- we- we might need some room. Hydrothermal event farm. Yeah, let's get that. Might need to expand uh, the areas. There's a lot of expansions available for these. We're gonna okay. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna need the money. Like Jesus. Is there a Marilyn? Is, does anyone see a Marilyn? He's in there. Does anyone see him? Oh, this is such a mess.
Okay, just just start sending shit off to the kitchen. I don't I don't know what I'm gonna need. Thank god fish keeps forever in this game. No, don't send all, don't send all. I have to do it one by one, because if I sell everything, then we we uh, it's all just gone. Send the tuna to the kitchen. Send... <laughs> Send all these to the kitchen. We haven't made that dish once since. This is supposed to be a shark tank. God damn it. The white tip one isn't even worth anything anymore. I need I need thresher sharks. <laughs> Send them, do I send them to the kitchen? Do I just sell them? The density's fine for now. Density is fine. It's stable. Density is fine. We're just- we're cleaning up. I'm gonna send the narwhal to the kitchen. <laughs> Oh god, uh, uh, this feels wrong, but he's not a shark. This is absolutely illegal. Okay, this one, there is no sharks in this environment, so they, they can just exist. They're fine. Oh my god. That's a, that's a reef shark. Hang on. Send, send the eels. Zebra shark. There we go. We've we've cleaned up a little bit. Oh god. I've been dreading uh, coming back here for a while. <laughs> Okay, so is, is Sammy, like, really just gonna take care of the entire farm? Holy sh- yeah, it's all planted. Look at that. That's fantastic. He, he seems to prioritize, like, a balance of crops, too. Actually, that's not kind of, that's actually not the best, because we wanted more garlic. We wanted more garlic. Um, okay, weather. It's raining. Oh, we might be in luck. It might be soon. Is that going to be enough for us? Like, the day after. You do still need to water, I think. Wait, do I still need to water the crops? Surely not. I paid him good money to do that. There's no way. Yeah, that, that that would that would defeat the point. That's like the most tedious bit. Yeah, he waters. Okay. Thank God. Okay, uh, I'll go get the horsehair crab then. Let's pick him up real quick. Let's see if we can find a shark or two. There's a sprinkler that waters them, but you have to buy it. Oh no, is he actually not watering them? I pay yeah, I paid six grand for a gardener. Surely he should be watering them. Oh, the fucking sniper rifle too.
to use it up. Is there any reason to, like, even call the drone here? It's gonna be carved up anyway. It's already dead. I'm, I'm gonna quickly... No, okay, I'm gonna get the horsehair crab and then I'm gonna go back up. I want the tranquilizer rifle back. Not a fan of this one. Weedy sea dragon. Take him out. Pretty sure he waters them, you just need to sprinkle if you don't. Yeah, I, I, I would be shocked if the game was that mean. <laughs> Hire a gardener and he's not even doing the garden. <laughs> Gonna be down here. They keep him watching one of these bits. Ah, here's his home. Uh, we'll give him some narwhal meat. I'm sure they'll love that. Glad you hired me as a gardener, by the way. The gardening costs extra. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what's he what's he even doing at that point? I'm just gonna come back and he's made like a sick song about gardening. Hot pepper tuna. There are boulders here which make me believe that the crab here. Oh. I heard a voice. It's coming from inside the cave. How to break through the stick ice. It pierces through the middle with something pointy, otherwise it won't even crack. Oh shit, wait, what's going on here? Someone's stuck inside. There's a shovel too, that, that's no good for us right now. I'm gonna need another narrow. I it, it's a real shame I just killed the narrow. <laughs> oh, thank God! Placement narrow is on the scene. Bring him on over. Could be enough now. I gotta do my best to avoid it. He's coming right for you, Dave. He's got blood in his eyes. Close. Go through the ice one and find a source of that sound. Uh, is this like because of the patch? Or is this just like epilogue content now? Go to new region. This is just new. Cool. Very stronger than I thought. I see some obstacles too. I have to focus and get out of here. Glacial Seaweed Cave. Look at this. Where am I trying to... Oh my god. Where am I trying to end up? This, this seems incredibly dangerous. My God.
He's the guy who got stuck. Oh, it's your man with the turtle, isn't it? Oh. I haven't seen him in a while. Tucci, oh. you're a human from before. What brings you here? <laughs> Heard sound come from inside. Are you trapped? <laughs> Came here to find some new seaweed with Donna and got trapped in here. <laughs> We've been living off seaweed up until now, but we were about just about reaching our limits. He came to help us. Thank you. No, I think I'm trapped here too. Oh. You're useless. <laughs> Might be able to get out if we manage to break through this ice wall, but it's too thick. Donna will be able to ram through it, but Donna is in no shape to do so. That's. Then we can hook a rope to that end and catapult Donna into the wall to break it. Oh, this is not humane. And the shell is rigid enough to break through that wall, but how do we throw Donna? How you close together? Like close. The only way. Come on now. This is not humane. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> this will do. Oh, it's too cold. Oh, a little longer. We can't escape if you did not. And Donna here, I'll launch down into the wall. This poor turtle. <laughs> this poor turtle. I got a launch. <laughs> oh, this is gonna take a few goes. This is really gonna hurt. Turtles in so much pain. Isn't the letter back isn't this a letter back turtle with a softer shell? Oh no. I think it is. I'm trying to get it perfect. But it's hard. <laughs> just into the ground. Break true, Donna. It's unnecessarily cruel. But they they want it a new game mechanic, so damn it, we're gonna we're gonna work with the resources we have. Gotta break through. <laughs> this poor turtle. <laughs> that was a su success. Good job, Donna. A chew. Head out through that door. <laughs> Feel much better now. Now I'll go with you. Talk to me when you're ready. Let me, let me harvest all these resources. Alright, are you ready to head out? Let's go. <laughs> they have accepted their fate. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> What the fuck is this? There goes Dave. We're free. Got us out of there safely. Thank you, human. Take this. What's this? An ice pick. You can break thin ice with it. This should be able to reach small areas blocked off by ice. 
Oh, cool. Okay, so they they really just added the update to expand this region. That's cool. Still getting new tools. Get out of here. Oh, this one sucks. Eh. It's probably the worst one. Yeah, the crab trap has been working away this entire time, so I'm probably just going to go and get it. That's cool, though. So they've just added onto this region now. Now I have thin ice walls that we can now break. Is there one down here? No, this is, this is too far down for ice. Let's hop back over here. Crab trap's been hard at work. Horse hair crab. Oh, we need it. Uh, okay, so there is still one missing here, then, is there? This is just in the glacial area. Maybe it's over on the left side of the map? Like, on this somewhere. I can see rocks there, yeah, I can see rocks to, to break something, but I didn't see anything to actually hit with them. Oh, there he is, you see him. Yeah, let me, let me hopefully get something to deal with him. A hush there. Come on, bud. He's frozen. I just pick him up. <laughs> oh, there's a rock here. I didn't see it. There we go. Golden King Crab. Another zone done. Just like assaulting him for a while because I couldn't figure it out. You can also shovel him. Oh, look, there's, there's like another spot here. The crab traps are single use each time. Yeah, there's probably a lot of crabs just to actually catch through all the old areas. It really is going to take a while for 100% now because of that. We can work towards our shark goal. Back to the boat. Okay, cook it all up. Narwhal's offspring acquired. <laughs> I want to see how the farm is doing. I, for some reason, I, I, I don't know why. I feel like I have to keep checking it. I want to just understand how it's working. Oh, wait, so he literally just hands it to you when you come back. So I'm going to need to get more seeds for you then. Uh, like, manage... He has a good few for now, but I'm gonna need to just put more in his inventory. It's so cool. The soil quality has never been better <laughs> since he took over. We go to the boat and sell some stuff. I might have to get a bit of 
cash so I can get more seeds. Sell. Oh no, I, d I don't. I don't think I actually can sell much here. I can just sell some topazes off. All of these, please. All these teeth. We're keeping these around. How much does it cost to get a new uh, crab trap? Good lord. I need to get the cargo box improved too. You can turn some stuff in on Eco Watcher. Let's just check all that off. See people's artifact. Here you go. Research fossils. Research shells. A shitload of them. I need so many of these. To even get the next rank. Some of these were like actually like like bring a Dunkelsaurus up to the surface. I I I don't want to do this. This one seems terrible. I don't want the points that bad. Look at the like look at the amount of like resources I'm gonna be losing. Like the environment's just not worth it. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Okay, quick little dive into the top uh, of the. Uh, should we just time skip? Should we just time skip? I think maybe we do for the first time. You can get another Merlin. Uh, okay, yeah, I can get another Merlin. Oh, let me change this. Oh, I forget again. Thank God. A Merlin? Uh, d d Marilyn. <laughs> Let me get Merlin the wizard. <laughs> like, they're gonna have a Merlin party where they serve him up soon. It's like, oh! <laughs> what source of his dinner? Serve him on a plate. They're gonna, they're gonna eat good soon. Let me serve some Merlins. Oh, no. We're gonna catch an old wizard. He's down here somewhere. He's been in hiding. Any, I don't know what I need. Is it you? I can tell, I can tell that's the shark we want. And yeah, we need you down there too. Give, give us one second. <laughs> oh my god. Quickly Dave, take aim! Take aim! Holy shit, he's getting destroyed. Quickly Dave, call the drone. Get the drone. Take him away. Oh, that was brutal. Oh, Jesus. They're taking Dave down. <laughs> like, we, we have to stop this guy. He's been, like, devastating the ecosystem all this time. We have to do something. Oh, I can't automate the farm in the sea people village as well, can I? 
Just realized I'm gonna have to still go down there for various bits. Tammy has no uh, jurisdiction there. Avoid the school of angry fish. Uh, there was one a bit deeper, wasn't there? Dave the Impaled. Oh, God. I love the kidnap animation. Yeah, it's great. I love it they're just packaged and whisked away. I don't even see the Marilyn. Oh, it's just a shark. Don't need that anymore. There's two sharks there. I'm like, no. This is terrible. Was there one that spawned in the shipwreck? I can't remember where he was. Yes, there was one. Okay. Let's hop on in real quick. There was a sailfish. Is that, that, that counts as a Marilyn, yeah? It looked look kind of close. <laughs> I got him like mid swing. <laughs> Take him away. Okay, where where are you? Oh, he's just he's just not in today. Devastating. I need to send the staff on a, a, a quest for me so soon, too. It's not guaranteed. Even the hammerhead is not here. Oh, no, we, we, we just captured him. You knew? Hedgehog. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just make our way back, then. There's not as much for Dave to do anymore. Instantly spawned. Don't mind him. You do a night dive to find uh, special sharks, maybe. I, I don't need any special sharks right now. Well, no, there's, there's one that won't spawn. He's just not here. Apparently, he's in the shallows. I should have popped down the lobster trap. I could have got something there, yeah. yeah let's cook a seahorse. Okay. I've got a good feeling about this one. This could be our most profitable night yet. Uh, also, you guys have to stop collecting mayonnaise. It's gonna be profits night. Let me just see if there's anything uh, that Sammy has that could give us more profits. 17 bags of rice, thank you. That's so much. Two point six kilos just doesn't seem right anymore. It's because we went all in like so, so early. The afternoon I can handle, but it's too cold and even freezing the dead here. Wait, do I even have his meal? I, I got the recipe. Good, wonderful. Please make that dish before I freeze to death. I'll be waiting. Do I have everything for him? Oh, good lord. <laughs> Sorry, Bacho. 
Poncho, I have like a truckload of fish. <laughs> take it, Poncho. Take it and cook. Oh, Jesus. Okay, uh, do I need to research that food for him? Tuna sashimi? Oh my god, that sells for even more money. How are we still getting more profitable recipes? That's 765, that's more than the final boss. Farmed fish, he doesn't like them. Um, okay, staff. Waiting room. You must go out. Was it for the miso soup? Let's check. Yeah, it's for miso soup. I just need him to bring some home for tomorrow. Uh, left control? Oh, there we go. Yeah, the Gatterin staff is here. They're gone for me, so they'll hopefully be back in time. You order some final boss sushi. I'm, I'm gonna pop it on the menu. It's just that and salt. <laughs> That's all you need. I put it on the menu. Can enhance this further. Ooh! Oh, but if I enhance it now, it's not gonna be worth as much. I won't have as much to serve. I got I gotta I gotta sell it as is. Sell the dunkle. And the rest I think is just Greenland shark. Get that up a bit higher. Use all the hammerhead meat, just collapse upon yourself. <laughs> Improve the recipe. Is this the best one of the cutscenes, too? I love it. <laughs> this poor guy. <laughs> it's so fucked. Yeah, it's on uh, 445. I can get the 492. Maybe in future we have that. We can improve the narwhal meat quite a bit still, but I. That's all the narwhal meat gone. We can improve this as well. Uh, I, th I think I just leave it for now. Okay, Greenland shark. Okay. This is going to be our most profitable night yet. Do we have the hot pepper tuna? I, I actually didn't see it. I don't, I don't think we have any peppers yet. Anyone see hot pepper tuna? Enhance the strip pure Maryland. I don't want to do that. How do I serve this man? I don't think I have what he wants. It was in research. I don't think it is. I don't see it at all. You had it. I. Where, where, where is the hot pepper tuna? I do need to serve this man. You'll have a blue person next to the dish. I don't think it's here.
I don't have any peppers yet. Okay, yeah, I just don't. Okay, we're overthinking it. Okay. Tonight is a profitable night. I can't serve him yet. He'll, he'll, he'll st stick around. Don't worry. We have work to do. They want the vegetable sushi instantly. It's first thing off the menu. Oh, I should not have taken this one. I need to get back for the wasabi. Everyone just keep serving. Keep serving. Shit loads of food just going out tonight. I gotta wait for this one. So I can serve it. There we go. We're selling out of everything. Keep grabbing it, Kang. Keep grabbing it. We need to clear the tables. Clear the tables. <laughs> That's pretty good. That might that might be the new record. Oh, that might be the new record. Oh, it's not. It's just shy. What's it? It's it because it, it says new when it's the best. It must be just shy. That must be like almost tied. We only made $23,000. Yeah, $23,700 uh, at some point. God damn it. Devastating news. We're dirt poor. <laughs> we have nothing. The investors will have your head. Oh, but it's Maryland Day today. God damn it. Okay, well, we're investing more in the farm. I'm not having this happen again. I need I need to expand the farm even further. I, invest 20 grand. Yep, do it. You can add nine tiles here. Don't do it. Expand it. Expand the rice fire. I got two achievements for that. High quality feed. Has he... Is he not watering them? <laughs> no, he must be. There's no way. He does. Yeah, we, we have to trust him. We have to trust him. He'll get he'll get right into the crops. He's gonna need more seeds, I think, because he's gonna run out soon. Let me see, uh, like, manage. I need, I need to invest in carrot and eggplant. Did I buy all his carrot seeds? Pepper? Yeah, he, uh, he's already planted peppers. We have the peppers we need. If those are already registered.
buy probably even more eggplant. Invest it all. Twenty of each. A little bit of garlic. Yeah, he's he's got all that, yeah. We believe it. We trust in Sammy. We're not going to need fish anymore. We're going to be sustainable from here. We will forsake the sushi farm. We're getting into the vegetable business. Here you go, Mochi. Not sure if it's going to be another event for feeding Mochi. But he does love us. Watch Sammy doesn't water. <laughs> Sounds so cursed. Where where's the hot pepper tuna? Did I really need to re No, I still don't have it. I no, I have the recipe. It's just I I need to whatchamacallit. call it peppers. Okay, see if we can get some more Marilyn uh for tonight. That's our main goal. I think we have to play Cook and Mama tonight too, because the contest is today's as well. It's D Day. <laughs> They're really both tonight, aren't they? Yeah. I hope the VIP visit does not eat into our time for the seasonal event. The seaweed farm is probably ready too now. Yeah, I'll let me get let me get the Maryland and then I'll dive down to it. Do we even try and look for these fish that have eluded us this entire game, too? Maybe it's you. No. A bit impossible to find. Check the far right. Let me, let me, let me hop on over. Yeah, we're gearing up the boss shark, don't worry. There's a storm coming soon, so we'll get a chance. The seahorses are a bigger problem than the fish. Honestly, yeah, like, probably. <laughs> See that being the case. Guys, please. <laughs> He's just running away. <laughs> Jerry! He took his friend. Not seeing How much Marilyn meat do I have already? Escape pod here. Where are you? Not enough. I'll check. I'll check the um the shipwreck again. Oh, current's my favorite. Dwarf seahorse. That's a new one. Oh God. Game game blipped. Use the fish finder app. I, I wish there was a way to scan for like fish that you don't have. Like I, I am trying to find this one. I 
Because, like, right right now, I'm just, like, scouring the ocean. And, like, there, there may not even be one here at the moment. So it's just kind of frustrating. Sharky boy. Maybe the shark's hiding because he heard of your crimes. I mean, possibly. They have killed a lot of his friends. Shipwreck over here? Could be. It was nice, like, like, because if you have a quest or something, like, it'll track the specific fish for you, and I actually really appreciate that. I just wish I could, like, toggle that. Check in here for a sailfish, and then if it's not, when we go back up. Or even down to the sea people. Might as well kidnap this hammerhead. That's <laughs> so while we're here. Pack him up. Now here's our sailfish. Oh, we'll take you in, too. I think 100% the fish sounds more frustrating than fun, to be honest. Yeah, that's, that's why I'm not arsed with it. Like, it, it just seems like a lot of work. It's mainly because it's randomly generated. Like, for all I know, there's, like, a super rare fish that has, like, a 1% chance of spawning in the zone. And it's, like, fucking Feebass or something, you know? <laughs> like... We could be here forever looking for that. Okay, we got our we got our sailfish. We're just gonna we're just gonna go back up. Going a bit faster through these days. Oh go on, I'll 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 pick you up too. One more. Coming with us. Check for stormy weather. There is stormy weather. There's rainy weather tomorrow. That's a good sign. I think we might have it. Get more bullets. Hang on one sec. Let's <laughs> keep shooting them. Extra. This one's actually worth quite a bit. I think he's the most, like, him and the Greenland Sharks are the most valuable ones now, I think. It's pretty good. I listen right to see if anyone else is having trouble finding this shark. They are, apparently it's called the Mako Shark. It doesn't spawn often in the late game. Oh, so is it just a super rare one that we're missing? Yeah. Yeah, there is one shark we're missing in this area that's just not here. Like, ever. <laughs> okay, crops are all grown. Come harvest. Oh, that's for the, that's for the seaweed farm. I might as well just quickly get this. And then maybe we just go back to the boat. The briefest of days. <laughs> Do 
Chat, they use shark skin to shave wasabi. I think sharks are not smooth. Uber Chain, how's it going? Good to see you. Yeah, yeah, everything in like the shark sushi shop is like, you gotta, you gotta really crunch into it. You gotta, you gotta work to even get a bite. Do us suffer it here. Oh, hang on, I'll, I'll, I'll help him too in a moment. Let's get the beluga. We'll make our way over in a sec. Seaweed farm. Oh, it's pretty good. Just just plant whatever we have. Oh, you guys, it's the seed shop from here. That's handy. Gonna have to have to dismount. Is there a different quest here? Something wrong, Lynchin. Seljo ran away again. I think something caught his attention. Shiny jellyfish. I think so. I've seen one near the glacial passage. I would ask you again, which you look for Seljo. Oh, the little octopus has ran off again. Let's help uh, your man who's sick again. I need to cook him a dish. I can call the beluga, but like really not for long. The costs are gonna quickly rack up with him. I heard you were a vegetable sushi trucer. You get me. We're trying to swing the entire shark sushi restaurant to just veggie sushi. Unfortunately, it is Maryland Day, so a lot of fish are about to be chopped up, but... Oh, she's gonna steam the crab for us. Look at this. The crab is no more. Oh. <laughs> Incredibly dangerous meal. <laughs> I packed it up for you. Please give it to Dua. Oh, she's like tossed it on the ground. Okay, I gotta... Hang on, where, where is he? He was in the workshop, wasn't he? Let me bring this over. From shark killing machines to vegans. I mean, in fairness, like, like vegan seems like a superpower in of itself. Uh, you know, if you've been able to do it, like, you're so unbelievably healthy and beyond the rest of us. That we cannot compete. Come all powerful. Okay, here's your crab. Nasty cough hasn't gone away. Here, why don't you try this? A steamed horsehair crab. Where did you? I went the glacial air and gave it to Mima. Good little delicious meal out of it. Hey, it's good for coughing. Let me try. It's gonna change his life. Oh god! <laughs> He's still sick though. 
Uh, I feel stronger. I feel like I'm first my energy. It's been a long time since I felt this way. I've never seen you so energetic before. Thank goodness. That one completely cured, but still it's giving me a good boost. Thanks, Dave. I can't give you much right now, but here, take it. I think if everyone is worried about me, I'll do my best to get my health back. Drop by the workshop anytime. Divine tree fruit fragment. Um, can I just plant that? Does that have to grow in the water, or...? It's just here. Oh, it's for crafted. Oh, right. So I for I forgot there's like some rare materials like that. Uh, what's over here that I still have to hand in? Grown divine fruits for hu humans works out so well for humanity. We should try again. <laughs> Yeah, it's like round two, you know? Like, oops, we lost half the population and almost doomed us all. But we learned from our mistakes, you know? Oh, we saved him from a cave. Thanks, Dave. Here's a reward for us for this, too. Here's Bladderwack. I thought I'd make some delicious dumplings with it. I added to the menu, try it later. I've, I've not purchased her dumplings like once. I, I kind of feel terrible. We've just not availed of this mechanic or system. Um, nor will we continue. Nor will we today. <laughs> because, uh, we're probably just gonna hop back. Uh, back to the boat. I need dumpling that makes the Mako shark spawn. <laughs> this is like the shark bait dumpling. <laughs> like one of these. Like, Dave, you didn't catch much. You just came back with some magic beans. Like, what's what's going on? <laughs> hey, go get the miso. It's Marilyn night. Uh, is there anything from the farm we can get that might help us? Very quickly. There's 14 habaneros, okay. Pretty good. Oh, and the construction size because everything's expanded too. I, th I thought something was wrong. It's a Merlin night. <laughs> oh, it's also the cooking show. Jeez, I, everything's happening tonight. Got three different things. It's time for the cook-off. This is Yui from NDC Station. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today's the day of the final clash and challenge the chef. Bancho, are you ready? Yes. How about you, Alex? Ready, my fingers are uncontrollably wiggling. Excellent, let's begin challenge the chef now. We must defeat this man from the United Kingdom. A lot is at stake. Kill him, Bancho! <laughs> but don't waste time on a cut in the sushi. Cut his throat. Oh, I gotta pay attention. I already made one mistake. That's not gonna cost me, is it? <laughs> Still said perfect. Roast the onion. That nice and fried. Look at this. Looks amazing. Loving the sizzle. Make a dip in sauce. 
Okay, add kelp to the sauce. Oh, look at that. Here we go, pour it in. It's all just blending together. Mama could never. Batter the fish. Come on. <laughs> Wait, what, what, what fish are we cooking again? <laughs> It's just a different one at the end. Deep fry it. Pop them all in, they're trying to escape. It's like just whatever fish we could find. Just toss it all in. Oh, there we go. That's not like thoroughly fried. <laughs> There are bits that are just raw. We're just missing. Does he have it? Yeah, there was no contest, really. Did he, he just made fish and chips, didn't he? I mean, in fairness, that is like a UK classic, you know? The good fish and chips are good fish and chips. I made a single mistake, so my score was only 99 this time. What Alex is fish and chips lost? What an upset, my fries are the best in the world. If your fish and chips are indeed taste excellent, incredible, actually. What is the theme of this contest? It's fried dishes. Not quite right, the theme for this contest was fried to sea. Must be fried cod is good in its own, but that alone does not represent the sea. Robancho's dish was... What kind of soy sauce did you use? Uh, chop green le lever and added it to normal soy sauce. I expected I like your shark and squid combination, but the highlight was your soy sauce recipe. Soy sauce enriched with the flavor of the sea better represent the taste of the sea. What an impressive flavor. Imagine Bancho just like adds like a cup of seawater, just pops it on, it's like, there you go. <laughs> That's literally the sea now. We're not serving tap water tonight. That's salt water. Whoa. There's still like a fish in it. Your dish gave me a feeling of exploring the sea from coastal waters to the deep sea. It was a fabulous adventure. The texture of your fried fish was good as well. But the game changer was your soy sauce. Alas, my perfect fries were not enough to satisfy the judge. This guy's just like, my chips. It's like not even like to do with the sea. It's just potato. My precious oh. chips. Close match. Hear what Bancho has to say. You need to be careful when making the soy sauce. That's... Thank you, Bancho. The champion prefers action over words. Wait a moment. Please, by today's contest, and would like to give him a piece of advice. You, I see your menu has expanded, but the drinks you offer stay the same, yes? Because I'm a chef, not a barkeep. I did the same thing before. Dine is a comprehensive experience. What do you pair up with your pasta? A glass of wine, a glass of cola, or just a glass of water? It significantly changed the dining experience. Place cannot satisfy the various tastes of customers with a limited selection of drinks. So my gift for you, it's a cocktail dispenser. Wait, oh no, do I have anyone who can serve this? I d Am I gonna have to serve this? Oh no, this, this is actually kind of bad. I have no one who can serve this. I'm, I'm gonna have to let one of my servers go. You're not in charge of drinks, that hungry looking guy is, hey, yes you. Look at this cocktail dispenser here, you'll find out how best to use it. Oh no. I'm gonna have to let someone go. Cocktails. The dispenser is designed to serve three different cocktails at the same time. Familiar with cocktails, we come to think of it. It's like a drink version of. Uh, Omakasi. That makes sense. It's our job to serve the drinks customers want. Oh, we try to make more money by adding cocktails to the menu. Oh, this might fuck everything up, though. Customers will begin to order cocktails. Serve cocktails as requested in the right order. No! 
Oh no, that's disastrous. Wait, is, is does drink servant? No, because drink servant doesn't count. That's different. Drink servant does not count for. Oh god, damn it, Billy! I, I'm gonna have to let Billy go. Billy's not. I need a clean and master who can serve cocktails. We're gonna have to put out an internet ad. I need someone different. Billy's gonna have to go, yep. Because I can't let James go, I can't let Mackie go, because she's like the, the best cook in the world, apparently. Atsuki is already serving drinks. Okay. Uh, right, we need to ready the menu. Cocktails, oh, it's 80 gold, though, if you serve it. Ah, this is a disaster. Oh no, we don't have nearly enough garlic! Oh, this is an absolute disaster. I can serve five of these. Wait, they make six servants. They make six servants. No, we're fine. We're fine. I, I can even afford to upgrade this. Everything's in ruin. <laughs> You're looking to hire Raptor when you have him as an option. Okay. Oh, okay. I gotta skip this one. <laughs> that was just way too much in the eyes. They put it on the menu. Put it on the menu. Auto supply. Auto supply. And then the next best thing is all the way down here. Oh god. If this recipe never deep fish tempura. Wait, second row there's one? Oh yeah, I need to make one hot pepper tuna. Do I really want to make it tonight? Because this is five servings for one guy and no one else is going to eat it. No one else will eat this. Serve that man. Okay. Alright, one thing of hot pepper tuna. You're being spoiled with five portions of this. Okay, and then I'm gonna have to just upgrade this a bit. I can't, I can't actually upgrade that one too much because that one is being used in these. I, I gotta sell out of these first, and then I, then add more to the menu. Okay. Th this this really may not be enough. This could be a rough night. Okay, I, I gotta serve this one guy. I got everyone else. Just get started. Battle stations, people. God. He's climbed an entire mountain for this moment. Keep him alive. <laughs> oh my god. That's an intense cutscene. The heat is. I can feel the warmth. I'm sweating. What a reaction. Glad you're not cold anymore. You saved me. Don't even know my name yet. I am Django, a wandering merchant. I can sell rare ingredients from all over the world. Yeah, thank you for the fine meal. If you don't mind, I'll drop by once in a while to sell my products at a good price. Most of them you'll be able to acquire on your own. I bet you don't have a truffle. Oh shit. 
This is a gift in exchange for your dish, and here's a recipe that requires a truffle. Should be worth looking into. Thank you. Pass and buy this place on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Cold in the evening, I'll drop by in the afternoons. I'll try to get good ingredients for you. Okay, so I gotta check the sushi restaurant in the afternoon now. Yeah, that's great on the new recipe, but there are, there are customers everywhere. Yeah, Django will now visit. He'll, he'll sell miso and stuff like that, which is actually really good. A secret recipe. You can learn his secrets. Uh, quick, we, we have to keep serving. No one order a cocktail. Please, God, do not order cocktails tonight. Trying to get people out of the restaurant. No one order them. Just trying to get people out. This is too many. Someone is not going to be served. Oh, you're right. Yeah, no, you get it first. Take it. I got that one. Just just keep serving the drinks. I got I got I got a poor one. Take it. It's alright. They're leaving. <laughs> They're leaving. We can't serve enough drinks. I ha I I don't think I've ever poured a drink. There we go. They don't mind if you overflow the glass. We we lost a few customers tonight. How do we do? Oh! It's pretty good. The bar goes higher. The investors are pleased. More staff need- I don't know if I can hire anyone else, can I? Oh, it's raining. Please be stormy tonight. It's stormy tomorrow. Uh, do we skip the entire day? <laughs> do we just, like, skip till tomorrow? I kind of want to train your staff. Don't do it. What do you think? Neat, right? Oh my god, so much. Look at all the vegetable sushi we're going to be able to make. Oh, it's doing so well. Okay, so he's, he's going to need more seeds. Hey, Sammy, how you doing? Uh, he's going to harvest the eggs. It just... I've been visiting every day, honestly. Uh, manage. I can extend the period. Do I get a discount if I hire him for longer? Yeah, I, I think I do. The five-day one seems expensive. Put you're on for a week. Let's get the harvest up fertilizer. You're gonna need this. Gonna need more of them. I have a lot of habaneros. I, I need to improve the veggie sushi more. Invest. Manage. Yep, he has he has all that. The veggie sushi will be our best dish soon. We must perfect it. I 
can train my staff more too. Eat the cat. So I, c I can only have like a certain amount of staff here. They're all gathering me, so. Habanero lobster. Is there any veggie dishes? <laughs> Don't think so. Do I need to get anything here? I maybe get that in future. I'm not arsed with it at the moment. I don't even need extra storage. Just improve the staff. <laughs> Cooking must go higher. The problem is serving them. Honestly, I think I want to just invest it all in uh, Itsuki. Just serve even faster. Maybe get a little bit of cooking training for James. Billy, you're gonna be let go soon. Do, like, do I have enough for the, for a menu tonight? I think I do. Oh my god, that, that sells for a lot with the truffle. Two servings of that. I can still sell extra Marilyn. Vegetable sushi, look how much! Oh, it's so good! Improve it. I don't know why he's cutting a fish, because there's none in this meal. <laughs> Just for show, we need we desperately need more carrots. We can make so much soon. Uh, I can just do serve up uh, thresher shark meat or something tonight. Use up some of our surplus. Let's improve it. That takes all our sesame seeds. That takes all the narwhals. Hot pepper tuna. Takes all the sesame seeds. We need more staff just to gather ingredients. Maybe I should train them. <laughs> Maybe I should train them a little. Okay, time skip. Dave is taking a day off to himself for once. Crops have grown down below, but have they grown here? This is more important. We need we need way more carrots. It's not nearly enough. Sorry, right, we'll get it. No, without Dave, the universe will implode. It's fine. The business can sustain itself for at least a little while. Uh, let's go to the to the farm real quick. We're just checking on the farm. Nothing else. Dave's grand day off. Yo, Dave, Dave's worked exceptionally hard. Yeah, he, he deserves some time. Just to himself. Remember, raptor. <laughs> Do not forget the raptor. I won't. We'll hire him on the spot. Billy will be immediately fired. Okay, seaweed farm. Yeah, that's fine. Seed shop. What ones did I need for like the best recipes that I had there? What am I actually after? I should have checked. 
I don't know how much of anything I have. I'm gonna go with the first thing I see in chat. It was gonna be like seaweed. The new ones question mark. Black coral it is. They were first. They were first. Shark. <laughs> the thing is, I think... I think we can maximize our profits now purely by focusing on the vegetable farm. I don't think we need to waste all this time diving for sharks. If we just focus on vegetable sushi and hire enough, that's all we need. It, like, we can make this Dave the Farmer, and I, I think I'm gonna make it work. We're never gonna dive again. <laughs> We've found the most efficient way. Like I, I think they even double down on this. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take off all the seeds. Uh, just okay for now. Don't, don't dispatch them just yet. There's no raptor. There's no raptor disaster. I'm gonna hire all of them to gather more resources. I'm gonna take off all the seeds that are not eggplant or carrot. Sammy, like, you have one job now. You don't like, like, what are these? What are you doing? Ka is a better raptor and has cocktail, does he? But, but can he clean? Could Raptor clean as well? Raptor can clean as well, so Raptor probably still is the best one. Raptor can clean and serve cocktails. That's the one we need, yep. We're just gonna have to put out another ad. You can clean it too, you know? No. No, uh, my job is to do nothing and let the game play itself and amalgamate profits. Oh, it's Ewan from NDC Station. Your very special guest today. But as you know, our guest, is, our guest in an ill-fated relationship with Boncho was a has-be, I mean, legendary actress. Oh, shit. Loji. Excuse me, the name is Lois. Long time no see, Boncho. The last time I saw you, you owned a restaurant at a five-star hotel. Not this kind of shabby restaurant. Practitioners didn't sell well or something. On the contrary, Lois. We have vegetable sushi now. The final boss. See, the restaurant critic who defamed you. Your story's from Miss Yoshi, right? That's she. Why to a lowly place like this? I thought you review only prestigious restaurants. My previous review of your restaurant became a thorn in my side. My reputation suffered from comments saying I was closed-minded, disqualified as a taster, etc. My career as a restaurant critic has declined since then. It's cause you're shit, Lois. All because you served me a disgusting dish. <laughs> Tried to make a comeback in movies, that didn't go well either. Pachato? 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 No need to speak of that. Pastro, the soul of Italy. Let me introduce Pastro and To Giovanni. I brought him from Italy to teach you what culinary elegance really means. Ciao, amico. I heard a lot about you. An oddball of a chef who uses strange ingredients to draw attention. You're just a showman, I will prove that today. Why do chefs and cooks stick to certain ingredients? Because they are time-tested and proven. Mm -hmm. Placing time-tested ingredients arbitrarily doesn't make a good dish. Your dishes are disgusting. Oh no, he's... He's speaking authentic Italian. He's making the hand gesture. Mm. I will show you. You'll learn why Italian cuisine has led the world for centuries. Driving for the past. I can't wait to see how it will develop. Today's theme is pasta. Why does the subject always benefit the challenger? Flash between two maestros. Let's find out whom Vincent will choose. Oh, the contest will begin in two days. Ah, oh, you're going down. We're gonna destroy him.
Pasta isn't just too on site. The Italian chef is certainly, definitely at an advantage. I saw a show on TV and found out that one of the sponsors of the show was the BNC Company. Mm. Famous restaurant franchise. Restaurants are all good, so what's the problem? Of course, they serve good food, use fresh ingredients as well, but the letter C in B and C represents Crawford. That's the problem. Lois Crawford's company, her family business to be exact, and she will one day inherit it. That's why she's quite knowledgeable in cooking for an actress. That she wants to get back at you using the show. Boncho's just too good, though. All she can do is select the contest theme. If it's Vincent's call, that matters in the end. His palate doesn't lie. I have a chance to win if I am well prepared. I'll cook squid and shrimp this time. Bring me Humboldt squids, white shrimp, wheat, and garlic. I have everything. Wait, I don't. I don't have a Humboldt squid. Oh no, I'm actually missing something. I'm the squid. They come out at night. Okay, I'll. Well, tomorrow night I have to go because it's shark night. Tomorrow is stormy, so I'm gonna be out at night anyway, so I can get it then. Okay. Um. This this won't be our most profitable night yet. We just don't have enough carrots. We need more carrots. But I'm gonna I'm gonna have a night where it's just vegetable sushi. And it's gonna be the most profitable ever. So I can serve this. I can serve that up. Get that just off the menu. And we'll just serve some Marilyn and soybeans, yep. Auto supply. A Greenland shark. Auto supply. It should be enough. It should be enough for tonight. Okay, what, what else do we need? It's just, For vegetable sushi, it's just that. I have all the mayonnaise I could possibly need. If I get some sesame seeds, I could improve this one a bit too. Okay, let's send out the, sta the staff for mayonnaise. We can hire someone too. He can serve cocktails, but he can't cook. no good. I'm gonna have to just like post another advert. Fly now. Hiron's in progress. Y'all know who's the second best cook? Ah, but James has been here a long time. James has been here a while, you know. We, got, we gotta let James keep working away. Trust James a lot. He's like one. He's like the longest serving staff member at this point. Is word hiring people just a dispatch? It might have been. It might have been. Okay, uh, dispatch. We need uh, sesame seeds. Send them out. Okay, I think we should be set for tonight. Just open the restaurant. This won't be our most profitable night, but damn it, it's gonna be a profitable night. Make certain of that. God, there's quite a few asking for tea. Uh. Gang is getting to work. Get these out the door. Get these out the door. Oh, Billy, what? Billy, you're going to be fired for that maneuver. Oh, you just cost us a lot of time, Billy. No wonder he's being let go. You better clean that table. Cocktails. Uh... I've already done it wrong!
monkey's colorblind. I'm not. It's Billy's fault. Billy, for fuck's sake, stop serving them. We gotta run faster. Uh. There you go. That's so not worth it. That just makes it harder. That takes so much time. Okay, Billy's Billy's definitely being let go after that abysmal performance. He cost us so much time. It's a new challenge. I want to throw the like the machine into the ocean. Just get rid of it. What kind of mail is here? Should I check it? <sighs> oh my god. But no, we just became a vegetarian sushi bar. <laughs> we just we just changed gears. No. You cannot escape, Dan. Oh, all the garlic suddenly gone too. Hang on. Oh my god. Coming in. I I need you to plant some garlic. Toss that in there. Your purpose calls for you, Dan. You cannot run. <laughs> oh god damn it. What do I even do? Because it's two opposite ends of the map as well to like, get the sharks. I mean, no, I, I just go to the glacial area, don't I? I just go to the glacial area and we just get the sharks there. God demands you serve shark. a new shark recipe if you train up uh, Itsuki to level 15 as well. Oh my god. It finally happened. It finally happened, but why like this? The game demands shark. Okay, glacial area. Let's catch the sharks there. Send all the farm sharks to the kitchen. Oh, I can finally harvest them all. Yeah. Maybe this is their time. I'm sorry, Mr. Narwhal. Just got caught up. You tried to go all in a vegetable sushi and the game is telling you that you're wrong. I'm not. <laughs> Oh, he's down here too now. Whales is deep in the glacial area. Oh, it's a bowhead whale. It's a different one. It's a whale lord. Big whale. Oh my god, his teeth. He's massive. Can I get a photo of him or anything, or is he just gonna exist? He's just had enough. Oh, it's not his teeth. Sorry, it's just like his gum or something. Okay, 
Oh, we need you. <laughs> Don't get eaten, Dave. What a st stroke of luck. Okay, send him out. I need to get the other shark that's down here. You're just in the way. Get out of here. Just gotta beat him down. We'll just pick him up as an extra. Uh, is there any bullets on the ocean floor? Thank you. The squid, Dan. No, I've... I've <laughs> we don't care about the squid. It's his fault for getting lost. We, we need sharks. Get him. No, I'm uh, sorry. Uh, that squid. He, he's at. He's at night. We're gonna get him anyway. Don't worry about it. That, that'll do. Go away, please. It's a nighttime only squid. Yeah, so we're fine for now. You, please go away. Please go away. You're not as cool as you think you are. And carve them on up. Our cereal and squid in the morning. <laughs> yeah, that, that's that's all we're grabbing. It's a short trip. Get back to the boat. Carve him up. Twenty-seven pieces. That's got that's got to be good. That's so much. Oh, hello. Who are you? What's going on? You're riding a raft. My name is Clara. I didn't expect to see a person on the sea in this storm. Have you seen a great white shark around here, young one? Tell me more. Can't be true. Klaus, the enemy of my husband, must be around somewhere. All traces lead to this place for sure. Us is known to be side only on stormy nights. On stormy nights just like this, it took my husband. That was 36 years ago. It will appear for sure. Everything leads me to this place. Well, I died several times. I noticed that the terrain changes every time. Not mistaken, the sea around here is very confusing for newcomers. I should just not have enough time to get used to it. Young one, can you find Klaus for me? I'm familiar with this place. I need to, need to find it before the storm passes. Locate it, and I will take care of the rest. Help this old lady, please. The final shark quest. I need to find his hideout. How long do you think she's been rafting? That must be really hard. To get anywhere you want. Okay. Find the vortex. Wait, it's already here? Does this count as a stormy night? It's not dark enough, is it?
This is this is stormy enough. It's only at night. We'll show up at night. Okay. Gotta gotta check out the farm expansion just so Sammy knows to expand here too. Cross this off. Don't do it. We need more carrots. We should have enough garlic now. Carrots and eggplant. Get planting. So much rice. Like, this is just constant vegetable sushi now. I need to do something with the eggs. We have a shitload of eggs. I just don't know what to do with it. Let me see if there's an egg recipe. Oh, the trader's here, too. Any, any eggs? Any, like, sharky egg? Tomato egg? There's an egg in that. Fried tomato and snailfish. Tuna sashimi. I mean, this, this one sells for 765. Mackerel scramble. That's egg, but profitable. Let me see on the menu. Once we get more carrots in, this is all we're doing. This is all we're doing. Holy shit! It's so much. Enhance it further. the most valuable di dish we can ever possibly produce now. Okay, here, here's our shark meat though. We, we've got this down. <laughs> At least. We have a wide variety of shark. Enhance it. Like 90 eggs. What am I going to do with all these? <laughs> I have 90 eggs. These ones make six servants. The bluefin tuna rice bowl. No, we, ju we just serve raw shark. <laughs> it's just raw. You don't need to prepare it any way other way for this night. Apparently this counts for the night. Oh, because the shark in it, of course. He's got a secret recipe for sale. Buy it. Is it shark? That, no, that's terrible. Despair. Got cucumber. He's selling salt. Actually, might be worthwhile investing in the spices. He sells truffles. Clear him out. Let's buy all them. Dang has been traveling to various places to collect recipes and now selling the ones he acquired. I bought one, it's pretty unique. The customers will like it. I need to I need to train. We must serve even faster. Billy's like probably getting a bit anxious, like, why aren't I getting any train? He's probably like figuring like hang on, something might be up. Okay, let's go to the boat. Um, do I just dive back down to the glacier passage? Is there anything to find if I dive in here right now? It's going to be stormy tonight. The new shark is here. Mako shark. Okay. 
There's a rare shark. Okay, let me dive on in. Gotta check it out. It's personal. Well, the great white one is personal for... Her. What was her name again? New character. Clara, that was it. Hey, where where is it? We are a man of singular purpose. It's at this depth level as well, isn't it? I don't need to worry about going deeper. Squid will be here at night. It's not night yet. Pretty sure I have... Yeah, I have those. Uh, we're looking. Come on. I can't even remember. Like, we, there was some dish before that involved that guy. And it was, like, so incredibly valuable. And now I can't even remember what it is. Is this him? Actually, did a lot of trouble. Package up. That could have been really dangerous. <laughs> I'm almost out of air. Just go up. Just go up. like job done shark acquired never punished oh and we got a baby one too for later perfect uh, sesame seeds just go get them again why not? One second as well. Sorry, I'm good. Sorry, I'm good. Apologies there. Just have to very quickly check something. He died live on stream. No, I'm good. I'm good. Don't worry. Sorry, there wasn't much time to just give notes or anything. I just had to go a moment. There's new hires? Oh, I'll, I'll check them after this. Okay, we, we have something very important to take care of tonight. He's down here. We also need to get a Humboldt squid, I think. Uh, pick up a bit of shopping. The real final boss of the game is here. 
gotta pick him up. Ah, oh, so, yo, know, just while you're getting groceries, you know. Look at that squid. We'll find him. Do I have the right gun? No, I really don't. I probably don't want this one at all. Just kind of standard. Could have equipped something much more powerful. Ah, uh, you know... If we're here anyway... <laughs> might as well just collect them. And you just gotta get out of the way. Dan, what's your favorite sea animal? Oh, you know, I've got a bit of a fondness for sharks. <laughs> oh, even we've seen quite a few. He likes eggplant the best. <laughs> A vegetable sushi. Where's this squid? What 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 depth does the squid spawn at? Is he further up? Below 50. Sky. Guy really doesn't want to fight back. Get him out of the way. Come on. So much stuff is just getting in the way today. <laughs> Where, where's the Humboldt squid? Before we fight this super boss. It's a different shark. We're not interested in him. We're looking for a big red guy. He shouldn't be that hard to spot. He's nowhere to be found. Honestly, might just be unlucky and not spot him. There's a lot of standard sharks tonight. Beat him up. I don't think we can even sell this or like, like during the shark night. It's it's not gonna be nearly good enough. Oh, we can if wouldn't we carve up the boss? We can sell him on the night. <laughs> oh, that actually might be our most profitable night. It's that it's gonna be between that and vegetable sushi on its own. Limited edition sushi. The best of the best. Is is he just not going to be down here? It's, it's just this shark. Where the fuck is he?
130 is the max. Yeah, I know that. I could have sworn we had a Humboldt squid. Is the thing. There's another one of these sharks. He's not gonna be this high up. There's so many tiger sharks. They're everywhere. We would have sold or served it. I'm hoping I didn't accidentally straight sell him. There's a good chance I did though, isn't there? Knowing me, I was like, that's not a shark, and like just tossed it. This is as far down as we can go. Can't go down further because it's night. Yeah, so don't spawn. Take that for the boss. Might be handy. Have max ammo. Maybe in there somewhere? I haven't even seen the vortex either. There he is! Okay, this is... Yeah, first of all, you need to get out of the way. Oh god! Okay, we need to defeat... One of the first sherry, the first scary sharks we encountered in the run. He's just so colossal. He'll take you out. Come on. I'm sure I've had one or two drones, so I need to kill him. He better not despawn. Yeah, I don't think he will. He's just gonna move though. There he is. Okay. Take him away. God, that took forever to find him. And we still have to find the vortex now. not seen it. Oh no, this guy. No, oh, you bastard. Get away. I'm trying to fight a boss. Don't even make good sushi. Wasn't worth it. I'm guessing the vortex is further up. Vortex should be above 50. Okay, let's, let's just make our way back up then. We have three final bosses left. Well, actually, I think we have like four. Jaws himself. Uh, Vegetable Sushi Knight, which I'm going to treat as its own boss. <laughs> be our most profitable knight yet. Um... An Italian man. And Shark Knight. But we'll go we'll go a little bit longer today and we'll just get it all in. Go a little bit longer. Like we don't really need to dive anymore after tonight. What about serving colored drinks? We're, we're working on hiring someone. Dave no longer the diver. Dave, Dave has done enough. Come on. 
Dave is going to retire at this point. I think I still have enough to take one more home. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Just an extra. Oh, it's near. Here it is. The vortex. It doesn't mean that there's a great white shark's hide out inside. Just go check check inside and call the old lady. Here we go. The final boss. The real one. It is that straight up the Jaws shark? <laughs> I mean, I guess it's a great white there, too. But, like, I think they've tried to, like, create him, recreate him as much as they can. I knew it was here. Let's quickly call the old lady. Where's the walkie-talkie? Oh my god, I didn't ask her phone number. Her ferocious look, I should find a way out before it opens. <laughs> they've straight up just made him look as close to, like, the Jaws shark as possible, I think. <laughs> Great white shark. I woke up. We need to buy time until our old lady returns. This is what you've been training for, Dave. I, I don't need a sniper rifle right now. This is where all your practice pays off. <laughs> Let's put him to sleep, Dave. Oh god, he's summoning tornadoes. <laughs> That's not very shark of you. It's a Sharknado. Oh my god, you're right. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna need to pop this real quick. Oh, that's why they give you the sniper rifle, because of this maneuver. They actually just put it in because Sharknado. Because why not? Okay, Dave, Dave, you need to be a little more careful. Dave. <laughs> Are you ready, Dave? Oh, my God. All the Dave's training and he couldn't do it. He just couldn't beat the final shark. How many have we slain until this moment? Oh, that's embarrassing. Okay, here he is. Lot of ammo. Oh, I've almost used up the entire scooter. <laughs> okay, might as well commit to it. Ooh. It's open fire. Bad time for him to enrage. 
I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. Oh my god. Get the oxygen. <laughs> Fine. Just keep firing. Keep fire. Just keep firing, Dave. <laughs> it's just a really strong shark. <laughs> That's all it is. All the other bosses have like these fun, uh, like, like these varied mechanics that are really unique to them. No, this guy is just a shark, and he's coming for you. Oh, this is this is significantly easier. Shot, Dave. <laughs> Justice for his brethren. <laughs> Many sharks have been slain to get to this point. He's pissed. That's a bad spot. <laughs> we got him. <laughs> oh gosh, she's gonna deal the final blow. <laughs> Finally got you, Klaus. I'm sorry, young one. I couldn't get familiar with this area after all. Great white shark making a whirlpool. I didn't see this coming. A rootless the whirlpool claimed my husband's life. Anyway, you gave it what it deserved. I must express my gratitude somehow. See you at the boat. I'll be waiting for you from up there. I think it was extra ferocious. Let me find a trophy to write home about. We're gonna have prepared the ultimate meal for Shark Knight. He is very mm -hmm. tough. It's fatty, though. Bancho will like it. Incredible. The ultimate shark dish. Hope she comes to Shark Knight. I hopefully it'll be thematically appropriate. Let's head on home. Oh God! Dave can tell his mom he killed Jaws. Like that was straight up just Jaws, wasn't it? <laughs> but like even with, like the details on the shark for like when he's been injured, I think it is. <laughs> Yo, great white shark, but specifically... <laughs> I was finally able to complete my long-awaited revenge thanks to you. Once I gave you peace. This view is a necklace made of teeth I broke off it during my first encounter. A shark toot necklace. Oh, that's amazing. It's like the final trophy reward for everything we've done. Oh, Sato's like, a super rare giant great white shark boss card? Must be a hardcore Marika collector. But you would risk your life to get rare Marika. I see an America completer in the maker. Guess it's time for me to make my from, for, way for the future generation. I'll keep an eye on you. Godspeed, yippee. Okay, Ash is retired. How does Finn rank 99?
Hey, what does the shark charm do? Increases base damage of the harpoon gun by 15%. That... I have to wear that. Because it's just a shark too. Considering how many we've slain to get to this point. is, is like, th this is the trophy we deserve. It's so good. Check the farm real quick, just harvest crops. More habanero peppers, that's fine. Okay, sushi, just small sushi night. Let me just offload some stock. We, uh, we, we don't care too much what we're serving tonight. Oh, I need to actually research, let's see. White shark omelet, it's, it's only okay. I think we can make better than this. It's only okay. I'll just research some more. It is 10 servants though, yep. Yeah, they're all out for sesame seeds. Uh, there's no raptor. There's no raptor here. Put out an internet ad. Get rid of them. There is only one staff member we're looking for. The rest of them, it's like, please do not apply. Get, get out of here. I desperately need carrots. <laughs> okay, I can make some of this. Auto supply. Uh, I might as well use up the miso on... Yeah, we can just make some Maryland soybean paste roast. Auto supply. Save the sharks. Grilled eel with habanero. Uh, I can improve that. Serve one of them. That should be enough. It's not shark night for a while. No, it's not. VIP is tomorrow. We're probably going to skip some time in the run-up to Shark Night. Just to get it. Okay, open for the day. Today we just make adequate profits. Nothing too special. This is not the goal. Oh god, she's so fast now. Look at her go. I'll serve this one. There you go. It's just speed running it. <laughs> yeah, we, ju we just need to serve up a little bit tonight. We're not we're not too fussed on the menu. There we go. Just about, yeah, just about like 17 grand. That's not our best night. Not our best night, but that's okay. Just need, just need some money just to keep the lights on and prep the veggie sushi. Seventeen grand chump change. It, honestly, at this point, yeah, yeah, it is. VIPs visiting today. All right, no, we're just we're just skipping time now. <laughs> wait, actually, actually, hang on. Wait, I have to go to the sea people when the crops are harvested. Money's just gonna be spent on hires. 
we've just a few singular things we want to do left. That, that was our final dive. We, we, we can't go diving in the ocean anymore. After we defeat the shark. We're done. We don't need more. We're like so unbelievably prepared for shark night. We have so much to sell. It may just be our most profitable night. Yeah, I know I say that a few times, but... Uh, what do, what, what do I want? I wish I could see how many of the resources I have. Just... <laughs> seaweed. Lots of seaweed. Shark slaughtered all of them. Like, there's none left. <laughs> that was the last one. Back to the boat. So, <laughs> Dave, what? You only caught some seaweed. <laughs> it was a tough day. It was a tough day on the job. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm gonna take the afternoon off, Cobra. Yeah. Let's just read a nice book on the boat. <laughs> Dave has rendered the sharks extinct. Well, time to call it for the night. Where's the raptor? There's, there's a wrestler. There's no raptor. Gray can do cocktails. Can he clean? Can he clean? Because that's, that's what we're looking for. That's what we ask him. Dre can do it. Can Dre do both? Nino has master clean and master drinks. Oh shit. Oh shit, that's it's not the raptor, but. Dre has both of them. Okay, we're gonna hire Dre. Uh, is there anything else I can expand? Harvest up fertilizer. Get some more of that. We're gonna we're gonna need a few more carrot seeds. Yeah, I'm gonna, uh, let's pay one last visit to the fish farm too and see what we can carve up. I, I think this is the time where we empty the tanks. Yeah, there's too many reef shark whiteheads. We don't, we don't need all these. All right. <laughs> Use all. <laughs> Carve them up. <laughs> Clear out the tank. <laughs> Use them all. <laughs> Just said it like boatloads of sharks. Like, Pancho, you're gonna have like a field day with this. There's gonna be no fish left. 
Use them all. <laughs> These guys can't even be used. You just got caught in the crossfire. You just got caught in the crossfire. <laughs> There's not even a shark there. Use them all. The fish farm has been emptied. Otto's probably like horrified. <laughs> this is this is not what I wanted with this. They're free. Okay, it's time for the cook-off. Settle the score once and for all. Mom, Dad, what was it like back when there were sharks? <laughs> that was a different time. Oh. Hey everyone, this is Yui from NDC. This day we've all been waiting for it, but whose victory with this long-standing conflict end? Boncho, are you ready? Pastro. Sono Pronto, let's get it started. Let's begin challenge the chef now. The final boss of cooking mama. Pancho cannot be stopped. I need to get it perfect. Don't mess it up. Prepare the squid. Wait. <laughs> Wait, up. Uh, no, it's D. Oh, fuck. Bad start. Uh, can I restart it? <laughs> I don't think I can. They've made it significantly harder. Perfect. I immediately got it wrong. Wait, what? What? It's a rhythm game. <laughs> they're just they're just chucking new mechanics. <laughs> it's significantly harder. It's it's not it's not working. It's not working. Hello? I'm I'm spinning it. I'm spinning it the correct way. It's not working. It's not working. It only started the work there. It's because my mouse sensitivity was too high. My no, it's it wasn't a case of it swapping. I was doing the motion. My mouse sensitivity was too high, so it wasn't registering the input. That seems really unfair. Oh god, this is gonna be a cuisine. Pancho's <laughs> doing his best. This looks so burnt already.
Like, th this is taking a while, as you can probably tell here. Oh no. Poncho, <laughs> you really fucked this one up? <laughs> Oh, no, it, uh, somehow. Wow, he must have done a really awful job. <laughs> How did I win that? Oh my god, he, he just did significantly worse. <laughs> Mamma mia, I can't believe it. I, Pastro and Antonio Giovanni. Defeat it in a pasta contest. I can't accept the judge's call. This this show is lame and not worth my time. Arvo. <laughs> He's just storming off. Guys, hot tempered. His cabanero was fantastic though. It was unbelievable. I like the combination of salty, uh, uh guancali and soft yolk sauce. It was heavenly. Why didn't he win, Vincent? It's Lois, do you know why squid ink is used in dishes? Is it for the color? Why bother making the color like that, though? Mm. Not really, Miss Lois. Yeah. Visual's only part of the reason. Squid ink is reminiscent of the taste of nature's seawater. Um. I taste of Bancho's pasta, I saw the dark and quiet sea. Mm. Black pasta and nocturnal sea creatures dot in the black sea. Whoa. I felt like diving into the dark, quiet sea naked at night. <laughs> now, why naked, though? Yeah. Tasting is a very subjective experience, after all. Even for a critic like myself, it's never easy to be objective. I yeah. like the taste of both dishes equally. Oh, I gave more points to Bancho for his near-perfect representation of the theme in every nook and cranny of his dish. For some reason, he forgot to prepare the squid whatsoever and kind of just left that raw on the plate. Not really sure what's going on there, and somehow he burnt the pasta too. Um, there, there was bits of, on the side of my plate, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> you do know the biggest sponsor of your program, don't you? I do know. Nolan Crawford, the chairman of the BNC group, who is your father. He's also my sensei. My father personally, how is that possible? He's been defeated. I was young, I worked at your father's restaurant in New York. Back then I was nothing but an inexperienced apprentice cook. I was lucky to be hired by your father. Oh, look at him go. My first job was cooking omelets. Though egg is a pretty common ingredient, it's one of the hardest to master. Very hard at the time, the perfect moment to flip the omelet in a frying pan. I was struggling to figure that out, oh, no. and... Hmm. Someone tapped my shoulder with a smile on his face. Yeah. It's your father, Nolan Crawford. Hmm. He's so confident. <laughs> Look at him. Oh. He kindly taught me uh, when and how to better flip the egg. He, the restaurant owner, didn't mind spending his precious time teaching a new hire. He's got egg riz. <laughs> Damn, you fry that egg well. Passion and creativity toward food were truly inspirational. He was always looking for new tastes and experimenting with new recipes. He fell more times than I can remember, but he would succeed in the end. I see. He's now an entrepreneur of a large corporation, but I believe his passion would never change. I can feel it. It's Lois, why don't you try Bancho's pasta yourself? You insist. He doesn't want to. No, oh, it's too powerful. <laughs> what is this evoked? It's too- it's too powerful. I admit, I was prejudiced. This pasta is incredible. It's not just the visual, it carries a natural flavor of each ingredient. I criticize the dish without even trying it. I am not worthy to be a restaurant critic. Don't blame yourself, we just have a different philosophy about food. Pancho, I know it's a rather abrupt offer, but... You'd be interested in opening a branch. Branch? Yes, another Bancho Sushi. Clearly there are many people who don't understand your food philosophy. But if they taste your food at least once, they will wake up to a new dimension of food. I want to have that mind-blowing opportunity. Your current restaurant is too small. Big enough for me. The restaurant is already widely known. People will visit your place in droves sooner or later. Be prepared to maintain the quality of the food you serve. 
opens a branch, you'll be harder from the control of food quality. Mm -hmm. Your staff members sincerely follow his philosophy, right? Yeah. They can be the manager of the branch. Wait, we can just set up a new one? Don't worry, trust your staff. They know what to do to live up to the reputation you built. Mm -hmm. Trust your staff and let more people taste your food. I don't have a management system and funds to open a branch yet. <laughs> that I can help you with. I know how to operate a franchise. I'm well educated in that matter by my father. I have the skills and money needed. We're going global. Oh. <laughs> Mackie's just gonna take over the next red chain. <laughs> Send the child. Anjo, I think you should give it a try. Mm -hmm. A good challenge for your staff to grow further. So everyone thinks I have no other choice. I'll open a branch. What am I supposed to do though? Order wooden planks or something. <laughs> what about the construction? BNC company will take care of it. You just name the manager and decide what to serve and what ingredients. There's a new restaurant open tomorrow. Mm. Becoming like, welcome to like, Bonch Donalds. Moving up in the world. Mackie's gonna make more money. She has to go, she has to take on the world. Like, Mackie, I know you're only like, 10 and your father's dead. <laughs> open a new McDonald's. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Like an actual, like, cargo ship arrived. <laughs> okay, so wait, how, how do, so it'll, it'll be working from tomorrow. Who, who's I wanted to hire? Was it Dre? Is Dre the one we want? For cleaning and cocktails. El Nino is very expensive. Okay, sign. Dre is on. Yeah, we'll just hire El Nino, sure. Because we're, we're going to have to send Mackie away, and Billy, you're, you're just fired. <laughs> Get him off the roll. You're gone. Okay, so Dre, Dre is going to be serving, is he? Dre's, Dre, Dre seems to be better static for cooking. Let's get him in. Dre for servant. Uh, now I need to train him up. Clean and he can clean up a messy seat. Just rapidly training him. Sir, servant's getting better. He can serve cocktails. Yeah, we need him. Can't miss cocktails again. Just invest it all. He needs to become as powerful as possible. Level 10. I cannot afford... Train at Suki. Uh, Maki, I feel like we're gonna have to train her up because she's gonna be leaving us soon. Dre, we'll get you another rank. There we go. You can look at El Nino's details. Haven't learned this skill. Haven't learned this skill. It's not there. Serving is good. Serving is good. But no, you're gonna you're gonna be on like um, resource duty. Uh, what what do we need? Probably need more miso. Everyone, <laughs> journey out for the miso soup.
Okay, vegetable sushi, we're not ready yet. We're not ready yet for veg sushi night. Uh, we can serve three things of this, so we will. Oh, we can serve some of this. This only takes rice. Serve seven. Is this the bright one with the knife? Yeah, yeah, I, I skipped that one. <laughs> Blind and white light. Okay, we can just serve this up and use some of the rice. Should be all right. Okay, this should this should do fine for the menu tonight. Open the restaurant. Tomorrow is veg sushi day. <laughs> hey, Dre, Dre is on it. Look at him go. I'll just serve the occasional one. <laughs> Only if it's near. Save us running. Can just walk away now. Like Dave, Dave does not need to be here anymore. The restaurant has become self-sufficient. Oh no! Took a bad order. Hey Dre, get on it. Make the cocktail. Keep going. Oh, look at that. He's serving cocktails and cleaning up. That's pretty good. Basically paid for his training there. It's pretty damn good. Lazy RT. It's the point of these games. We get to the point where it is self-sufficient. <laughs> we will run out of fish eventually. But we do have a lot of fish to serve. Oh, Lois is calling. Miss Lois, the branch is ready for business. That quickly. Administrative agency of BNC Group is the top of the industry. This is the branch with Bancho. I will see you there. Oh, lovely weekend, Dave. It's a transparent fish. Okay. There's an invisible fish. Transparent ghost squid. Okay. Leave him for now. We can go to a branch. Oh, shit. New shop has been established. Look at this. This is... This is just brand new. This is the branch. This place gives off tropical vibe. I was like, my taste, but it blends in well with the surrounding environment. Look at this. Time proven theme for restaurants on the beach. Let me explain how to run your branch. You need staff members to run your business. Open the staff menu below. Oh, I'm gonna need more staff. I'm gonna need way more. You need to hire a manager to supervise the business there. Of course, you need to staff the dining area and kitchen as well, just like a HQ. So you need a minimum of three staff members to open and run the branch. Manager is most important. This is the number of degrees available and the number of customers depend on the stats of your manager. Let's do a point a staff member with the highest stats to the manager position. Manager cannot run the business against the operation policy of the HQ. Set an operation policy to give guidance to the manager accordingly, accordingly to which the manager will prepare the menu appropriately. I can instruct the manager to serve what I see. The manager wants to serve as I see fit, like expensive dishes or dishes with the most ingredients. Grade of your manager determines the ingredients used to the branch. Holy shit, there's so much here. 
We're supposed to be finishing the game in like 20 minutes. <laughs> There's just so much stuff just got added on. Click deliver. Oh my god, like the game just never ends. It's great. So like, let's let's send this fella over. Okay. And I now in a second restaurant. That means twice the revenue. Well, if you run it successfully, I might add. Let's see how it goes. Before people experience a culinary revolution, I am sure they will love your recipes. The branch of Bancho Sushi is now open. Assign a manager employees to the branch and send the required ingredients to run the business automatically. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, we, we need staff to come back with the miso soup. We don't have anyone right now. The staff needs to come home. Just leave it abandoned for now. Yeah, just, just skip time. Dave's taking the day off. Oh god, there's... I, I need to train up so many people. We do not redispatch. Re we, we need to train them up. Okay, yeah, go to the farm. This is my night for veggie sushi as well. Veggie sushi combined with the branch. Let's see how this goes. I'm genuinely shocked how the game keeps going. Check branch at six. You can just see it on the security camera. Okay. Right, so we, we need to get staff trained up. Okay, Billy, uh, I was too hasty to fire you. We're good, we're good. We are going to need you. Let's train up El Nino. Glad to have you back, Billy. Uh, please do not ask for more pay. You should be grateful to work here. Clean and master. Pretty good. Uh, Kyoko, we're gonna have to get you back on board as well. We we just we just need people tonight. <laughs> Yeah, this is this is all the staff we have. Um, we could we need five people, so I I need to train them up. Yep, yeah, you're you're both being promoted. Is there anyone to hire? Mitchell or or okay, he might be a good chef. He might be a pretty good chef. Sign them on. Okay, get them. Get them to a rank seven. Because I'm gonna have to get. I'm gonna have to get people cooking.
Spending all our money just getting staff together. Okay, um... It's between the two of you. Uh, keep more tradition, we will ignore you, Sky. Just additional training. Get everyone a bit more powerful. Uh, training. Okay, I'm gonna guess. Does the branch make less than the main one does? So I want, like, do I want to save like my best for here? Depends on the manager. Who is my best manager? It's probably not Mackie. Probably gonna need to keep Mackie here. It's probably Itsuki, isn't it? Okay, yep, you, um... How do I, how do I put staff on the other one? Dre's the best manager. <laughs> okay, all right, Dre, Dre, you're gonna, Dre, we're gonna just send Dre out into the world, okay. Get removed, Dre. Oh, no, but I, I need cocktail served. Yeah, I do. It's the whole, free, it's the whole reason we fucking got him. Clean and serve cocktails. Is there no one else here that could manage it? Ah, uh, these these guys kind of suck for it. Okay, Itsuki, you're go you're you're going out into the world. Hey, right, staff. So branch manager. We're gonna, we're gonna need to add uh, some recipes in that. Um, we need you on cooking. Uh, Kyoko's gonna be back on drinks. Billy's gonna be back. I trained up an extra staff member for some reason. Okay, maybe, maybe, uh, hang on, swap. El Nino. Billy, you might still be let go. You might still be like, oh, Billy. No, okay, no, it's gonna be Kyoko for now. No, but I, I need a staff member on the other one. I'm one short. Okay, uh, hang on. Okay, Kyoko. They will do their best at this other branch. Okay, bring on El Nino. Can train you a little bit more. Okay, uh, we need to prepare the menu both here and in the branch. Um, oh god. Oh, uh, it's veggie sushi night too! Nine hundred and thirty-seven. I'm gonna serve it as is. Don't upgrade it. Auto supply. Veggie sushi is on the menu tonight. We could supplement it with some Marilyn. 
I love to pay $937 for dinner. <laughs> it's a fancy place. This is the menu. For tonight. It should be enough. We need that we just save the shark. Okay, if we just send them this. Maybe it'll be enough for the branch. I'm, I'm gonna need to send the branch quite a bit. Ingredients. Oh my god, they need so much shit. <laughs> oh, this, this is actually an overwhelming amount of information. Usable menus. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I don't want to throw just random garbage in this, though. Give them what you want to serve on the day. Rice. It, 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 this is hard to work out what I want to serve him. Current manager cannot use the high rank in ingredients. They can't use rank 9. Right. Um... Okay, th this part I actually really don't like. This this is actually just overwhelming to process this information. This, this is a lot to take in in one go. I wish this was kind of simplified. Check operation policy. I, I don't know how. Operation policy. Price. That should be right. Okay, ingredients. How do we work out what to sell? I, I feel like I'm looking at a spreadsheet. Like that's, that's, uh, that's my problem right now. Should I just give them all the shark heads? I can give them them. Hang on. Let's give them all the stuff we don't want. Shark heads are not worth much. I don't think they're gonna be able to do that though. Uh Maybe some of that. I just give him tuna? <laughs> I can give him a shitload of tuna. I I, can't, I don't know if I need that for something though. Like that that that's the problem. Cause if I go back, cause I don't want to sabotage my own menu. I think this is cool in concept, but yeah, I'm very quickly overwhelmed with this. This, this is a lot at once. Deliver. I'll just send some lobsters. <laughs> it's, it's not gonna make much money.
Yeah, send send the angler fish over. And the thing is with a lot of these low quality dishes, well, I've never upgraded them. So now if I want to do this, I got I gotta upgrade all these menus. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna ignore the branch, actually. Yeah, I think that's like I like the idea of this, but this is this is way too fucking much. And I'm I'm just overwhelmed. Like maybe give them that. They have some possible menus. Yeah, I, I actually, I don't think I like this. This is just too much. And it's like micromanaging too, and I, I actually don't really like that. Uh, take some of them. Got some buck bean. Yeah, we'll just see how it gets on then. We'll just see how that does. I wish I was- yeah, I think that- that system is way too fucking complicated. He's been playing for six hours, give him a break. It's not even that, like, I'm not, like, tired or anything. I just think that's, like, an overwhelming mechanic. I actually don't really like that. Just because you have to micromanage every meal. That just feels like- that just sounds like a lot of work. Every game, everything comes back to a factory game in the end, Dan. It seems it, yeah. Could just easily be the same way the basic one is. Yeah, it just could be. That'd be easier. All right, let's go. Sushi night. Vegetable sushi night and an extra. <laughs> just because we have it. Let's make profits. How, how, how's the branch doing? They should be all right. I'm not getting the better tips anymore because it's spread out there. They are generating profit in the branch for what it's worth. Look how many people want vegetable sushi. This is how it should be. Take your veggies. Enjoy them. It's the only thing left in the menu is vegetable sushi. This is the sushi restaurant I want. Ideal sushi bar. How's uh, uh, the branch doing? Oh, they, they just closed. It's it's through the roof. It sold so much instantly. Here's the net profit. So it's an extra four grand. Because I'm going to have to send them more. Someone someone got pissed off. <laughs> I'm going to need to give them some sharks. To make shark night work. It's party day today. Prepare the right ingredients and make a fortune. Okay, let's do this right. This, this is the final day. We're gonna leave it with this. You can see the branch. It's not that far away. 
Okay, the menu for today is crucial. This is Shark Knight. Okay, we will serve Shark. With the Dunkle. And t t Greenland Shark. That should be enough. And now what I can do is I can give them the Thresher Shark, the Hammerhead Shark. I can give them all these. Because I think that's going to be enough. There's like 15, 30 of them. That serves 10. Okay, check on the branch. Ingredients. Okay, seafood. Oh, no, wait, they're not going to be able to prepare any of them. What are they going to be able to prepare? They can serve this one, Mega Mount Shark. Can I train? Uh, Tsuki up real quick. Level 14? Suki seems to have prepared something for rank 15. Does this make a difference? Shark Karage? Excuse me? There's a, there's a shark recipe. Hang on. Where is it? Where, where is it? Can I even make it? <laughs> you have to research it. Black tip reef shark and copper shark meat are batter fried. I don't have enough! <laughs> oh, disaster! It's not ready. We're too short. Oh, that's cool, though. That's probably a significantly better use than the meat. Well, we're just gonna have to serve raw shark again. <laughs> Whoops. Maybe I won't ship those ingredients. I'll, I'll make sure to keep those ones. Okay, black tip and copperhead, wasn't it? So, th save these two. Uh, maybe sort by rank or something. Is that way we can filter out some a bit faster and see what's at the top. Yeah, you're gonna be serving a lot of Mega Mount Shark. <laughs> of 54 pieces. That's all they're gonna serve. That's it. That's the menu. That's all they need to serve tonight. Is that fully upgraded? I, I think it was. Let me just take it back real quick and see. I can upgrade it for 34 pieces though. No, it's not worth it. No. Just just sell it. No. Just sell it. Just Cuz then we don't have to worry about like what they've got. You are the Mega Mount Shark restaurant now. That is your job. Make Bancho Sushi proud. That is, the, that is the only meal they need. Okay, and we will upgrade... Uh, they're cooking more. Don't think I can upgrade much more. Oh, 
There we go. Places, people. Places. Today is Shark Day. Skip time. This may be our most profitable night yet. We have the shark sushi, like, branch ready as well. To help us, too. One last time, let's visit the farm and harvest. Very important night. <laughs> Just all carrots. He's run out of seeds. <laughs> Savvy, I've got nothing left for you. These plan it too much. Just, uh, Sammy, just put on whatever the fuck you want. Grow, grow that pepper. Remember hot pepper tuna, yeah? Oh, God. Okay. It is at last shark night. This will be our most profitable night yet. Oh, you failed the Ah, Udo, that's your own fucking fault. <laughs> Get away. No one cares. We end how we began, with shark. Where'd the cats go? They were on the farm or something. I've... Where are the cats? Maybe they just ran away because it's they leave at night. Oh, okay. Okay, s s places, people, places. Tonight will be legendary. Let's cook. They all have little shark hats. It's all it's all you could have ever want. Here you go. Serve them up. Oh my god, there's so many in the kitchen. We, the, the servers cannot keep up. Oh my god, we're trying. The branch is doing well too. Okay, grab that and go. Grab that and go. Keep them served. Keep them served. I can handle the, the, the short form orders that are near me. <laughs> There's your beer. <laughs> I didn't even eat all the boss shark. They didn't want it. They want it raw shark. <laughs> it wasn't our best night. We couldn't break it. I think it's because we have too much staff. We have to pay everyone. Wait, no, this isn't including the branch, is it? No, that's extra. Okay. No, yeah, it's, a, it's our most profitable night. There's an additional 10 grand.
No, we made more. The report is only for 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 uh, the main restaurant. Yeah, we have thirty nine thousand dollars. Yeah, we. That's the new record. Shark Knight has done it. Dave has conquered the ocean. And with that, we're done. Uh, this has been Dave the Diver, everyone. I hope you's enjoyed it. Thoroughly enjoyed this game. Uh, that was really fun. I didn't expect it to be nearly as engaging as it ended up to be. Dave can just retire now. He can rest. But yeah, thanks for joining me, folks. I know it was, it was a long stream tonight. Hope you enjoyed it, though. I had a great time. Uh, thank you to everyone who subbed. Thank you to everyone bits. Thank you to the mods that ever been on hand. Uh, Stream-wise, I'll be back on Saturday. We'll be doing something Saturday, Sunday still. Uh, there'll be Dave highlights going up the next uh, over the next week as well. So uh, this stream will gradually get over there. So it'll be more of the watch. Yeah, that was great. Uh, I think from here, like, th th apparently there is, like, a super secret final boss if you collect everything, but that also sounds kind of torturous just for random spawns. So, I'm I'm happy to just leave it there. Like, I mean, the other things to do is kind of, like, maximize your restaurant's efficiency and stuff like that. <laughs> Honestly, if I was to keep playing it, what I would probably just do is, like, I would make, like, the branch just serve vegetable sushi. <laughs> Seems like an easy one to do. Easy way to get money. There's probably more in-depth ways of doing it too, but I, I, I'm just, I just feel like I'm looking at a spreadsheet. I literally am looking at a spreadsheet, just kind of managing where resources are and stuff. Like that kind of stuff just stresses me. I don't know why they don't make like, that just simpler. Just make it so like, hey, you just pull from the ingredient pool. Like, I don't understand why you need to transport stuff. It just makes it very overwhelming, in my opinion. Uh, but you also just don't have to avail of that feature if you don't really want to. Oh, God. Yeah, that is it for tonight. We're going to leave it there. Uh, let me see. Who is going to be going a while? Uh, we haven't rated Sips in forever, and Sips is a lovely guy. So I'm gonna I'm gonna leave you with Sips. Go say hey. He's playing some Planet Zoo. Sounds like a good time. Uh yeah. Thanks for coming, folks. I'll see y'all over the weekend. Have a good night. Take care.